they tend to kind of give this idea, um, you know, that obviously that Jesus is not God and, you know, he was created. And I'm like, okay, if he was created, when? Right, okay. And right. show us the right. Bible. So, so, so I don't know the date when he was created. Okay, so that's one but thing. I know, that, listen, so that's right, one listen. thing. Yeah, but wait a minute, wait a minute. You don't know. But I okay. know that he was created before the earth and all other creation. Okay, show us, show us the scripture. Right, to okay. To prove that he was a creation. Alright, shall we look at um, Genesis chapter 1? Let's okay, go. this is a scripture you know very well. Of course. Okay, yeah. so. Genesis chapter 1. So I might look at the camera just to yeah, see. Yeah, no, it's Go ahead, Jeff, you're in the hammer, are you? Yeah. Oh, is it? Genesis chapter wait, 1. Wait, wait, no, wait, 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 wait. I think it's Genesis chapter 2, actually, I'm talking about. Okay, okay, so you give me one verse and I'll give you one verse. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, uh, where is it now? Well, I'll tell, you, I'll tell you, let me just quote it, yeah? Let me quote it. You know, you know this one. You have to give me the verse, bro. Yeah. Now, anyway, let me tell you what it says. You know what the verse is, yeah? Listen, saying, listen, 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 I'm listen, listen. God said, listen, God said, let us, listen, okay. God said, let us make man in our image according to our likeness. You know what scripture that is, yeah? My, is yeah, yeah I think that's missing. Yeah, all right? That's what Jesus, that's what it was, that's what it says there, yeah? Okay, so what's your point? Well, it says God was God said, let us make man in our image according to our likeness. God wasn't speaking to himself, he was speaking to someone else. And who is the someone else? Right, that someone else would be Jesus. But he wasn't called Jesus at that time. Okay. So yeah, Jesus was there during creation. No, 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 don't get me wrong. But I said, so, listen, listen to what yeah, the scripture says. Down, you want to read the scripture and see, just read the scripture so that no, the you audience will know. Yeah, but my one, the page is missing because it's an old Bible. Just, just <laughs> oh, give me the Bible and I'll read it. Do it, do it, do it. The pages are missing. You. I'm generous. Yeah, no need to help me, babe. Bro, just, just read the scripture. You know what the scripture is, don't you? So, yeah? Yeah, so Genesis 1, verse 26. Is yeah, you want me to read? Oh, you're going to read it, don't no. no, you can. All right. right. Genesis 1, 26, yes. And this is what it says. And God said, let us make man in our image according to our likeness yeah and let them have domination over the fish of the sea and over the fowls of the air and over the cattle and over the earth and over every creeping thing that creeps on the earth right okay so god was speaking to somebody exactly so yeah. you believe it's jesus yeah so wasn't it so when was jesus created when was he created? He was the first of all created. I don't know when, I don't know the time. Okay. Can so you then you can't substantiate your claim then. Yeah, so but but why the why, why does it. why does the time, why does the date have anything to do with it? Because Jesus But he was created before the earth was, wasn't he? Okay. Because he so, was there in the beginning. Okay, so you've established what I believe also, which he was there at the beginning. Yes. But where we differ is is Jesus created or uncreated? I believe he's uncreated. He's always been there and he never was. Wait, guys, created. move out, move out the way of the camera, bro. Move out the way. Move so out the way, bro. We're, we're filming. Move out the way. Yeah. Could you guys go somewhere else? Man? Leave her alone. Give her some space, man. So, anyway, so, so, so I'm just making a point. Yeah. You need to basically substantiate your yeah, claim. But, but what I'm saying to you is... Wait, this. no, have a finish, have a finish. No, no, let me finish. You need to substantiate your claim because you're saying something which is very, very loaded. And I believe, my, obviously you know my position, which I believe is heretical, and this is the reason why. If you cannot substantiate the claim based on the internal evidence of the Word of God, it's better not to say it. But does God because say it? Because that does... means the only thing you're going to resort to is gossip. Our religion is not a religion of private interpretation like it says in First Peter, in, in the book of Peter. Yeah. This is not a faith uh, that deals with private interpretation. You go by the Word and let the Word speak for itself. Right. Okay. The Word says is that there is no day, there is no time right. for Jesus being created. Now if you believe so, 
Show me the book, the chapter, and the verse. Right, so, so, so you are saying... Otherwise, so, you lost the debate. Okay, bro. So you are saying everything that God established has got a time and a date written in the scriptures. Everything created does. Not things that are uncreated. Created. Things okay. that are uncreated like God. Okay. There is no date and there is no time. Right, so, right. So you... Yeah, 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 bro, bro, bro. Go ahead. You're saying yeah. that everything, yeah, that God has created, no matter what you say, has got a time and a date. That's what you're trying to say because I'm telling to you that the date doesn't matter. All I know is the fact that Jesus was created before the earth. Show me the verse. But you just read the verse. No, it's, I'm, what it's showing me is that God created man in his own image in the beginning. Is that what the verse says? Okay, look, look at the verse 126. It says, and God said, let us make man in our image, after our likeness, and let them have dominion over the fish in the sea, and over the fowl of the air, and over the cattle, and over the earth, and over creeping things that creep upon the earth. What's God so, so it doesn't, this is not a verse where you're providing evidence to me right. that gonna, Jesus was created. We're going to go so on. my though. friend, yeah, this is, try again. We're going to go, 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 go on further. We're going to go on to that. So, so... So of course, now, listen, can I give a verse? Because you can, no, no, wait a minute. Let me finish off this one and then we go. Let me ask you another question. In that do, scripture do, there... What do you want the people to know you about? Wait, wait, wait. Yesiah. Yesiah, okay. Yeah. Yezziah. So, so that scripture that you, you've just read, right? Okay. It says, God was speaking to somebody, was he not? Okay. Was he speaking to anybody? So, I believe... Yeah. And I don't know whether you're going to... He's speaking to himself. So we believe, I believe in a triune God. So I believe in the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. And I believe as members of the one divine Spirit of God, Father, Son, Holy Ghost, three divine persons in one Spirit. Right. I believe, yes, they can communicate with each other. Okay, so where in that verse is the Holy Spirit? In the chapter verse. No, 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 no. I want that same verse there. If the Holy Spirit is God, also, all you three of them. The name. Yeah, bro. So all if three. You go to the, if you go to the. Yeah, but no, no. That scripture there. Yahweh. No, but in that scripture there, it only it speaks of two people, not three. So you show me where okay, the Holy so Spirit is are there. You, are you isolating the text? I'm not isolating the text. No. Okay. So it doesn't say the Holy Spirit is there in the beginning. In fact, in fact, the date you're referencing, you can even find in verse two of Gen Genesis chapter one, the Holy Spirit. Yeah, but no, I want to. I want. No, 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 because we don't do this. We don't do isolation of verses. But, but if, 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 read the context. No, bro, but if Jesus, bro, is Jesus, God, if Jesus and the Father, bro, Jesus, Jesus and the Father. Where it shows us the date that Jesus was created. Yeah, no, bro. You're inferring. No. That's what we But the scripture there, My if friend. you look at it, bro, come on, man. You know, the scripture there says yes, right, about God said to somebody else, let us make now, man now, in our image. Now. Right? Okay. But that is Why two can't people, be, not three. I've heard arguments, a very poor argument from other Unitarians, who say that this someone else is an angel. So that you don't forget. But where's the third person? So, so tell me why it can't be an angel. No. You've said to me, bro, that your, your trinity is three gods, three people in one, who are one wait, 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 wait. god. You said so you should be okay. there. Why are you saying three gods? All right, one God then, right? But it's three different beings, isn't it? Why are you saying three different beings? So is Jesus not a different? Is Jesus and the Father the same being? Do you not? Do you understand what the Trinity is? Yes. Okay, what? Is it? Right. Your 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 concept of the Trinity is that there is Father, Son, and Holy Spirit. Yeah, all three. Are the Son of God. What's the name? No, we just ain't got a name, but it's the Son of God. That's a I'm not a de I'm not a denomination. I know you. Yeah. Well, what's the denomination of that church? Be honest. Yeah, we're just a, we're just a, all, right, put it, all right, all right, call it that. Call it that. So, call it that. Well, yeah, go on, once again, call it, call it Unitarians masquerading. Yeah, go on. I'm masquerading. We're masquerading as yeah, an angel of light. Yeah, go on, go on. And it needs to stop. Right, okay. All right, let's okay. move on. Anyway. Let's move on. You, still, no. you haven't explained to me, really. No. The you, problem, you haven't no, explained you, to me no. where the Holy Spirit is there. So let's move on. Yeah, right. The Holy Spirit is not there, though. Come on. Let's be honest. You're struggling. Look. All right, I'm struggling. All right, I'm struggling. You haven't, but you yeah. haven't showed me the Holy Spirit there in that in the creation, in the beginning, in that verse. You want it in this verse. Well, it's got to be but there because you said that all the telling you says. already. It says, and God says. Yeah, but where's the Holy Spirit? So we believe that the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit is God. But it doesn't and say Holy Spirit then. You're looking...
This is what you call. All right. This well, is what you call a sort of um, an absent fallacy. Okay. Let's okay. move on then. Let's move. So on. you're trying to look for a word that's in the context. Right. Let's move on. But I, I, I'll risk this. Let's, let's, no, we'll let's move on. Right, go on, yeah, go on. Just, just to respond. Um, just you know, respect the conversation. If we go to um, Genesis chapter one. Yeah. Look at verse two. Yeah. You tell me, well, yeah, I know that one. It says, and, okay, in fact, let me read verse one to give the context so people can understand. Rather than just isolating scripture, it says, In the beginning, God created heaven and the earth. And the earth was without form and void. And darkness was upon the face of the earth. And the Spirit of God moved upon the face of the earth. God said, let there be light, and there was light. Right, okay. Okay. So that's a, different, that's a different scripture to the one we saw. You know, that verse giving you, that is giving you the context. I could read a whole chapter with you, and we could go through it. But, but uh, obviously, for the sake of time, yeah, okay, um, we're, 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 I have a question. No, wait, 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 you're willing to, but I'm fine. Let me just, just say something fine. Sorry, so what's it? Let's just agree. I, I like you to, what, what I've done, design, is I've helped you. Okay. So you were trying to understand where the Holy Spirit was. And I've helped you. I've taken you to the second chapter, second verse of Genesis chapter one. Let's, uh, let us agree that in 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 Where in, 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 in chapter, yeah, brother. Let's no, let, let's agree before we move on no. that in the verse you showed me okay. in in um in in uh, Genesis chapter two, the Holy Spirit wasn't there. And you went back no, no, to chapter. That's, that's not my fault. Well, yeah. Okay. Okay. Let's move on. Okay. Let's move on from there. You can understand basic verses. All right, you can. I'm, let's I'm move on. on. Let's move on. You ask me your. Because I've showed you the Holy Spirit. Yeah. Okay. You, in that yeah. same chapter. Okay. You. I think, ask I think that's question. generous. But then I'll, you ask me your question. Do you have a spirit or now? Okay. So let me show you a verse. Oh, I thought he was going to answer the question. No, no, yeah, it's, it's, okay. it's a question. Go on, go on. But, you know, um, let me show you something. I'll take you to John chapter 8, verse 24. All right. So I'll tell you in advance what I'm going to do. Yeah. Let me get my phone out. Look how crystal clear. Never be so we're going to go. John 8, verse 24. John 8, John 8, 24. John 8, verse 24. Alright, let's this. John 8, verse 24. You ready? Yeah, go on. Okay, look what it says. It says in the King's James, I said therefore unto you that ye shall die in your sins if ye believe not that I am he. Now, I want you to remember those three words. Mm -hmm. I'm, one second. I am he. Yeah, we're, we're having a debate here, bro. No. Yeah, that's Jesus. That's Jesus saying, I am he. You will die. If you, if, if you believe not that I am he, you shall die in your sins. Now, do you, he who? Does it say? We're answered. I am he. Just remember that. You're going to see what I mean. I'm going to show you two more verses. Now, look at this. Do you believe that Jesus spoke out of me? Of course he did. Okay. You're saying, of course he did, yeah? Okay, so we have in Bible Hub, you go to BibleHub.com. BibleHub.com. We have in the Aramaic, the English. Yep. So look, Aramaic Bible in plain English. Now check this. I said, Rubbish. I said to you, you said shit. that you yeah. shall die that in your sins. Really no right? sense. For unless uh, you shall that means believe that, the Bible, that I am, the Bible is not real. Bro, I can debate because, you often. No nah, man, I'm talking to my okay, friend no here. Problem. If you don't like it, fuck off. I'm what here, do you mean? Uh, try to I'm tell here, me man. something. Uh, um, um, the Bible I, says I, I said to you he's living that God, you shall die and then in the same Bible he says he's not God. It doesn't make sense. That I am a living God. You shall die in your sins. Who said that? If you don't believe, lies. These are the words of Jesus. Lies, bro. Look at it right there. The Aramaic Bible. Yeah, yeah, let's go we don't believe. Let's wait, pick wait, one verse wait, out. Wait, yeah. Just look at the context. This isn't the only place. Yeah, bro. Let's look Hold at the context, bro. Don't worry, it's okay. Relax. So go back, relax. not just the one relax. verse. Yeah. Don't worry, we'll go back. I'm go not back. running away. I'm here. Bro. Don't run away. Okay, listen. I'm, what I'm trying to show you is how crystal clear this is. As it says, 
be a banana. <laughs> Back in you... the day, Okay, so if I said to you that you shall die in your sins, but unless you shall believe that I'm the living God, you shall die in your sins. But who said that? So you want the context. I want to know who said so that. So by context, what's, what's suitable no, for bro. you? Who go, said no. Do you want to go another verse no. behind? I want to know who said that. Jesus said Right, show me where it says Jesus said okay, it. Okay, no problem. Okay. So look what it says in the Aramaic Bible, which no. you believe Jesus spoke. Right. Okay. It says, and he said to them, you are from below and I am from above. Yes. Who do you think that is? Well, yeah, Jesus is from okay, above. So yes, Jesus. Yes. yes, yeah. Okay. Then. You are from this world. I am not yeah. from this world. Okay. So and carry then on. he goes on to say, Show me, yeah. which I've read already. I don't. Yeah. So let me see. It's the next. So it's the next verse down. Yeah. But then the next verse. Down, so so what? So that was. So that yeah. So yeah. So look what it says in the Aramaic. Mm -hmm. And I'm gonna let Shalini be my witness to this. Look what it says about Jesus claiming to be God. It says in the Aramaic Bible. I said in plain to you English, that you shall die in your sins. For unless you shall believe that I am the living God, you shall die in your sins. Hallelujah. Right, no, no, if I tell you, listen, Hallelujah. now let me tell you, let me, let me, let me, let me, let me, wait, 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 okay. wait, 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 no, because it's, I'm for the original wait, wait, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. So, Good. you're the same person that is saying that Jesus is created. Right, 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 he's created. Wait, so, so you haven't given me the date or the time. Right, because no, it's know, not there. Yes, I will respect that. Yeah. I know it's tough. It's a tough game. Yeah, it's going to be tough for you in a minute when I go to show you the next scripture. I'll okay. show you the next scripture. Go on, go on. It's okay, man. Go on, bro. No problem. Because no problem. where it but, says but, I am, but then, but and then, the original, it doesn't say I am, you know. You know that it actually has the name of God in there. Listen, no one's, I'm not even going to Exodus 314. <laughs> I could go Do you there. know it actually says the word of God in there, in the original what text? What I'm showing you is John 8. Yeah, yeah. But you know that big I yes. am there. What is that big I am in there, in that property? Right. Who made that? Who put step. that big I am there? On the original, it doesn't say step that. By step. Yeah. On the original, it doesn't step say that. By bro. step, because I had to help you. No, no, you didn't have to help with me nothing, where bro. You come. Up. Was the first listen, verse you wanted. Yeah, because listen. I helped you. No, you didn't help me you because be, it was in my, be, my on my mashup Bible. It was missing the page. Yeah, sure. But listen, okay. that it says in the capital, I am. I Who am put that there? Is the that in the original? Words. Okay. So is that in the original? Are you denying? I'm yeah, uh, denying that it's not in the original. Oh, excuse me. It's are not, you it's denying? In the wait, 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 In the original, denying, it says the name of are God. Are you denying there. that Jesus is saying he's God? Are you denying? Yes. Jesus is not now God. Now you're going to embarrass yourself. Because you right. Said that. Right now you've no, bro. No, you asked one question. You can't move question. on. No, me answer now. Me now. My because turn. It's going to be my bad. turn. It's going to be bad for you. My Let turn. Let him down. Let him down. My turn. Let's now. Let's just go to the book of Colossians and let me see. What oh, it says oh, about Jesus. Oh, no, Colossians so 1. Remember, I said yes. I'm going to show you another verse. No, 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 you've had one verse. No, you bro. no, 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 no. my I'm time to move on. Plenty of time. Colossians me, 1. Bro. I'll spend time with you, bro. What this <laughs> Colossians 1? Colossians 1, Colossians 1 14 and 15. I'm not going to go. Go, go, 14 and 15. Trust me, I don't, huh? I'm not going to run. Well, Colossians 1, 14 and 15. Let me just, oh. let me show you, because remember I said to you, in the King's You didn't know that you ain't getting nowhere at the moment. You're just trying to... Let your don't audience don't worry, feel worry, something, but you're not saying nothing. <laughs> you haven't proved anything yet. Don't, don't worry, relax. Right. 14 and 15. I said to you, I'll show you one more verse, and then I will go to the verse. Yeah. 14 and 15. 14 and 15. Okay. Is that Colossians 14? In okay. whom we have redemption through his blood. Whose blood? Jesus' blood. Yeah, but I'm talking to him. Wait, wait. Uh, Gene, but then you, if you read further down, it tells Gene, you what... Who is the image of the invisible God? Yeah, and go on. What else? You don't know yeah. you. The firstborn of every... Ah, oh, the firstborn okay. of every okay. creation. No, no, no. You don't understand. The firstborn first of every creation. No, 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 no. Exactly what I'm saying to him. The firstborn okay. of every okay. creation. Okay. Okay. Jesus, the invisible okay. God. The firstborn of every creation. Jesus can't be created if he's God. Okay. Thank you. Okay. No problem. No problem. Are you ready? Okay, I get it. Are you ready? Okay, so Isaiah... And there's other scriptures that say that. Go on. All right. Let's just make sure we're in Go on, bro. Okay, so Isaiah 46, verse 4. Yeah, go on. No, no, you... I've got more scriptures for you, bro. Don't worry. Go on, go on, go on. Wait, you go... Anyway, I'm you, you, I'm going to read... you now, you're only going to have maximum <laughs> you, Go on, 10. go on. Yeah. That's it. All right, go on, go on. Not go on. even 10. Yeah. I promise you. Go on. I've got but scriptures anyway, for you anyway, that I want you to no help me. Yeah? So you show okay. me. Anyway, so... Let's go to Isaiah 46. I'm going to read yours. No, bro, come on. Let's be fair, man. Because uh, where you, wherever you're going to quote, I'm going to go to. Right, so what you want? I Isaiah 46, verse 4. It might even be in this one. Nice, one. Isaiah 46, verse 4. That's a Quran. Isaiah 46, verse 4. I may be 
you're speaking now to some yeah, no, let's go into Asking which um, Isaiah 46 verse 4 Asking which translation yeah. you want Yeah Because they did, they did Where you going bro? Is it working? So you're talking about this one, yeah? Even your old age and grey hair, that one? Yeah, 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 you can go through. Yeah, even your old age and grey hair, I am he. I am he who will sustain you, and I've made you, and I will carry you, and I will sustain you, and I'll rescue you. Okay, so who's talking? You tell me, you're, you're the one saying it. I know it mentions I am, but saying I am doesn't mean anything. I no, am? No, no, no. It's not just I am. What's he saying? It's I am he. I am he who? I don't, okay, I don't so, you, you no, explain. See, now you're reading it in, in a sort of disingenuous way. Who's talking anyway? Who's talking? That's what you're going to tell me. You I mean, tell you me. Know, you, you brought the scripture, bro. You brought the scripture. You're saying it's Jesus. Yahweh's talking. So is that Jesus or, or Yahweh? So Yahweh is the one divine spirit of God. Yeah, but, is, but we're talking about Jesus. So now you're saying it's Yahweh. So Jesus is Yahweh. Jesus is, the Father is Yahweh. The Word is Yahweh, the Son of God. So Jesus is Yahweh, all the of them are Holy Yahweh. Spirit is Yahweh. All of them are Yahweh. So could you They are one spirit. Yeah, bro, 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 bro. Yeah. Three yeah, bro. You, you, I know you listen, listen to me. Bro. You're I know, I know. Yeah, yeah, uh, <laughs> listen, listen, listen. You're telling me that Jesus is Yahweh. Yeah, you're also telling me that the Holy Spirit is Yahweh. Yeah? Now, and the Father is Yahweh, yeah? Yeah. So there's three of them, yeah? Three or yeah, there's three, three or there's three beings there, is there not? So beings, where do you get the word beings? So it's not a being then? Not three beings. Three not Yahweh's, not beings. Three so, Yahweh's. So there's three Yahweh's then? Yeah, not three Yahweh's. So, but, but, you said, but you said all three of them is Yahweh. Okay, so what you're not getting, what you're, so I think you have a, I think there's a bit <laughs> of a crisis here with, you understanding God. Bro, you've got a bit of a crisis no, here, No, no, I don't. You need to explain to me, that you're telling me, listen. Right. Bro, this is sense. There's three beings you're talking about yes, here. Yes. You said all three beings are one. All three have got different names. There's, there's three of them, yeah? So there's Father Yahweh, okay. there's Jesus Yahweh, and Holy Spirit Yahweh. Okay. That's what you're saying, yeah? Okay. Is that what you're saying? Okay, no. Oh. Let me tell you, let me tell well, you. Well, I'm confused now. Yeah, where you're getting confused. Yeah, go on. Is you don't, you're not understanding the um, divine persons. Yeah, but that's divine person according okay. to Trinity belief. Your Trinity belief. Your Trinity belief. No. You, but no. Bro, bro, come on, man. You're saying, listen, you're telling me, listen, this you're, not, these not guys are my witnesses. Me. They're here. You're telling me, right, that Jesus is Yahweh, Holy Spirit is Yahweh, yes. and the Father is Yahweh. Yes. Right. So, but that's your Trinity concept that all three are God, the one God. No, we're not. Okay, we're saying, yes, our, our belief. Yeah. Is this the father is a man Yahweh is a man is so the father is a manifestation of Yahweh the son so is, so, is a, so so it's an image of Yahweh not the real Yahweh what, wait, just listen listen because you know bro it's gonna be <laughs> so, the, the, I'm confused the son, already no, you, bro that's what I'm no, saying because we know your view you're Unitarian yeah yeah go on so the son is a manifestation of Yahweh the Holy Spirit is a manifestation of Yahweh. But they're not the very beings. You know what not, manifestation yeah, is? Yeah, yeah, but they're not the very being. Okay, so we don't believe. So, There's no, not, no Muslim, no Unitarian can show us one verse in our Bible where we worship three Yeah, okay, fair words. enough, fair enough. Can you do that? No. All right, wait, wait, wait a minute, wait a minute. So, let me, so, now, so, now, so, now wait, ask, wait, bro, let, let me, give me, your time, you're my you're time now, bro, me. come you on. You haven't even let me finish what I'm saying. I'm just literally responding right, to what I'm saying. The point I'm making is, you are saying, or giving the impression, and you can clarify just now, excuse me, that we worship three separate gods, because the way you were saying it was like, we worship three separate gods. Now, let's not be lazy, show me in the Bible, right. give me one verse out of the thousands of verses in this Bible, out of the 66 books in this Bible, right? right? Show me one verse. That's all you have to okay, do, okay, okay. and then you've won the game. Right, okay, listen, listen, all right, my that turn. proves that we worship I didn't one, know. two, three separate gods. Otherwise, right. otherwise, it's over. All right, okay, bro. All right, my turn, right. 
Now, first of all, turn to Colossians 1, yes, 14 and 15, and read that again, okay. right? And then we'll have a, and I'll ask some questions there. And I've got two more after that, yeah? Because now we're talking about whether Jesus at a beginning or I can not. I tell you where you're going. All right, yeah, we're going, we're going, we're going, 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 going. I know where you're going. Just, go. just going, yeah, I've got, I got plenty of same going anyway, to anyway, read that. Let's read that to your audience, yeah? To your audience. Yeah, but your audience is going to be watching your video. Okay. Go on. No, sometimes he deletes them. Oh, can I... <laughs> Say that again, Michael. I didn't hear yeah. what he Anyway, let's go, bro. Come on, yeah. yeah. At least you're filming. Of course, your evidence for... What All right, come, bro, oh. man. Come on. Uh, Colossians you 1. You recorded that on your channel, if you want. Colossians yeah, 1. Yeah, yeah, let's do that. 15 and 16, yeah? I mean, 14 and 15. And read that. Okay. Two of them together. Fourteen and fifteen, yeah. Okay. In whom we have redemption through His blood. Right. Who's that talking about? First of all, Jesus. Right. Okay. Even the forgiveness of sins. Yes, that's Jesus. Yes. And then sorry. fifteen. Fifteen. Who is the image of the invisible God, the firstborn of every creature? Right. Anything else? Right. So Jesus is the firstborn of every creature. Okay. Right? So is is um yeah. is is Yahweh or or the the Father, is he not the firstborn of every creature? The Father is not the firstborn of every creature. Right, so Jesus was born. Jesus was born, he incarnated in the flesh. Right, so Jesus was born. Born in what way? What sense? You talking well, human sense? No, what the scripture says. It says. No, 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 let's let's be clear. What Jesus ain't the first born on earth, is he? No, but what? You, I, I'm going to answer your no. definition. All right, let me. All right, listen. But, we're but I, I want to try and understand. Right, but we're looking at scriptures, born. yeah. Yeah, first born. Right, there is describing okay. Jesus okay. as the first born of every created thing. Is that the Father? Okay. Yes. Okay. So the firstborn is not the father. Right. So Jesus is separate from the father okay. then. Because before no, you, we, no, I'm comfortable with saying that the father is distinct from the son. The son is distinct from the Holy Spirit. Right. So they're different. I'm comfortable with so that. they're different. When you say different, what do you mean? Different beings. See beings again. <laughs> Okay, yeah, no, no, let me let, no, let me let me if I'm if I'm not Come understanding on, God, what you're saying, bro. when you say beings, what do you mean? Right. And he's a being, he's a being, he's, he's a, a being, being. Okay. I'm a being. We're all different beings, yeah? We're not all the same. Are they human? Yes, they're humans. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. So are you applying human logic to the supernatural? No, because you've told us these guys were listening. They were listening. Yes. And you said Yahweh is Jesus. Yahweh is the Holy Spirit and Yahweh is the Father. Yes. But now you're saying that they're separate beings. Now you're saying beings again. Oh, so what are they Let's then if they're not the beings? beings? So that we're on the so same what are, So what if they're not so beings? So by being, do you mean spirit? So, so are, are they just air? Say one second. They can be seen. You get what I mean. <laughs> so by beings, do you mean essence? No. Are they being? Because this one says Jesus is the first born brother. Okay. So is I that can, a being? Is that a being or not? Let me, because I can, the thing is, you're, 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 you're kind of struggling. <laughs> <laughs> That's it. Go on. Right, I'm struggling. Go on. Go on. Go on. Go on. Yeah, I'm struggling. The definition. You need. I don't no, want to know the definition. No, 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 Remember, I'm biblical, you're so I'm looking at what the. I'm bad, yeah, okay, okay. Bad. Because you're not making the distinction between spirit and a human being. So spirits can can spirits be seen? I mean, come on. Is Jesus a spirit? The angel appeared to Mary. Yeah, bro, did Jesus is Jesus? Bro, is Jesus a spirit? Is Jesus a spirit? Is Jesus? Yeah. Okay, I mean, this is what this is what my whole point. My whole point is that the Word manifested in the flesh. Right. So Jesus at that time was flesh, or was he a spirit? What time was he? Flesh? When he's when listen, he tells us that he's the firstborn of all created things. Oh, but you're looking at it. You're looking, yeah, but, but, bro, but that's okay. what the scripture says. He says he's the image of the invisible uh, God, finish, and it finish. mentions that he's the firstborn of all created things, bro. So okay. we're we're going around. So, so you're comfortable, according to the word of God, yes, that he is created. He says the firstborn of all creation. 
It's gonna, it's gonna end bad. I'm it's gonna end bad for you, bro. Because I've got another scripture to show you that he is. No, no, don't worry, don't worry. Don't worry. <laughs> it's, it's, you know, I don't think you realize. Oh yeah, saying. right. right so okay, you're okay. saying to me, you're standing here telling the people that Jesus is a created being. Yes. As in, as in the sense that, like God made him. Made him. Yes. Yes. Now, remember, my first question to you was, show me the verse, you could not... Forget about it, bro, verse. forget about now that, we... we this about <laughs> now you want to forget about This the guy Bible. was here, he's my witness, he's so anyway. It. Everyone's heard it. Yeah, yeah, alright, don't, don't need to patronise, bro. Anyway, okay. No need to patronise, but just, just explain you what we're saying. Verse that you can even go back yeah, but you, 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 you need to okay. explain that verse there, sir. Now, this verse, talking about firstborn, this is referring to the ranking. No, it's not referring to no it's ranking. Okay, so Where does it say the ranking? Show me. Where does it say it's the ranking? Looking up some scholar, right? Now let's go to the um, let's go to another translation. Right? Yeah, now uh, yeah, yeah, but listen. Okay. Go on, go on, go on. Let's look at another translation, mm. just so to make it simple, because King James can be a little bit. All right, explain that away. Go on. People that are not studious, it's a little bit hard to. Yeah, yeah. Right. People who are not. So let's <laughs> let's make it simpler for you. Let's make it. No, let's make it. No, let's, make it like let's make it easy. <laughs> Knock him out now. No, I'm just saying that. For some people, you know, English is not their first language or just need, things need to be simplified. There's a different textual yeah. Yeah. Bro, you're simplified waffling. Come on, man. You're, you're waffling. So I'm, I'm going to help you. So, you're going to help you. So if you look at the Amplified Bible, look what it says. That's the worst one. So, so Amplified Bible, I don't know if you guys read that, but it says, Colossians 1 verse 15, it says, He is the exact living image, the essential manifestation, I said that, of the unseen God, He's the image oh, of God, yeah, he's the image, he's the image, yeah, we see, know that. Had you read this, you would have... Well, we know that he's the... But I know that... We all know that Jesus is the image of the invisible. It tells us that. He's the, the image. He's the of God. No, Jesus, listen, huh? Jesus is the image of God because he, 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 he represents see, God, doesn't he? You haven't even finished the verse and you're struggling bad. <laughs> it's this guy. Yeah, go on, no, go on. Carry, uh, you, you carry on, sir. Carry okay. on. <laughs> okay, the essential Solomon. manifestation... Solomon, my brother. How are you doing? You're right. Of yeah, the right. unseen <laughs> God. The visible, look representation of the invisible the firstborn the firstborn but look at the definition the preeminent one the sovereign yeah and who's the, saying that excuse me, excuse me. and <laughs> the originator of all what? right who's saying that Wait, hold on. of all creation who's saying that a trinitarian saying that isn't it what Trinit <laughs> oh, is this a Trinit who's saying that what then who's saying this who's saying it then the you know bro this is the amplified Unitarians, bible they this is, listen who, they have a bro, faith who wrote the who, you have a faith of gospel <laughs> The Amplified Honestly. Bible is using the Amplified I'm Bible, yeah? I'm, which is a, which is a word of somebody else who is a Trinitarian, Listen. yeah? Okay? How do we know? Well, of course it is! Okay. It's an Amplified okay. Bible, okay, so bro. what's your version? Right, okay. What's your version? Um, wait, 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 wait. What version are you comfortable wait, wait. with? Let me, let's, let's, He's let's... panicking. All right. I don't know. All right, you go, guys, let's, let's, oh, oh. I'll continue. Oh, let's, let's look at, let's, let's look at Revelation 3, verse 14. Turn that up. Revelation okay, 3. So wait, uh, verse are you, are you 14. Are comfortable with what I read? It? What do you say? That, By the whatever way, you why say. Why did you stop at 15? But, yeah. Anyway, listen, wait, bro. No, no, no. I, that's the first I want. No, listen. No, no. Let's go on to Revelation. We'll, listen. We'll go to Revelation. All right. We got go time. On. Relax. It's okay. So look. Look at verse 16. You're, bro, you and know that you're waffling. Waffling about what? You're waffling about the subject, bro. How? You're waffling. How? We're gonna get to the point, bro. We got to the point. No, we haven't got. I to. You're waffling, you that bro. He's the preeminent one. It's all right. About okay. Ranking. All right. It's, it's not you about ranking. Read it's not one about ranking. And take all right. In isolation, so you. Bro. All right then. So you're saying that the fa listen. So, so you're saying that the Father is greater than Jesus. The Father is equal to Jesus. So, the, so Jesus the is Holy not. The Holy Spirit is equal. So which? So Jesus. why? So why is there a ranking then? So who was the ranking? Who's the who's the, who's the, who's the, the ranking who's the amongst ranking? who? But you're talking about ranking. You just said it. Okay, let's go. Let's go back to it. I showed you. You're trying to be sly. But <laughs> you, you know, did I speak ranking? Okay, didn't look. he speak about ranking? Not me. Look, so I want to know I who a rank means that someone's higher than someone. Hierarchy. The invisible representation of the invisible. That's the word. And, and it mentions flesh. firstborn. Hold yeah. Hold the firstborn. The preeminent one, the sovereign and the originator. So who is the firstborn, the sovereign? The, and the originator. No, it's giving you the definition. That's why they call it the Amplified Bible. So, People like so is the sovereign the firstborn or is Jesus the firstborn? The sovereign is representing the ranking of the originator. It's the originator that is the one that initiates him. And so is Jesus the sovereign? Way, by the way. So is Jesus the sovereign? By the way, you're reading it out of context. 
because if you read the next verse, which, you know, people watching, they're smarter than you. Bro, you're you know, still waffling, bro. They're smarter than Is me. Jesus the, is G, listen, it mentions there, you said there's a ranking, the yeah? Next verse. Let's read the so next is one. Jesus it's the okay. dominant form I know or it's not? tough. It's a tough gig today. <laughs> <laughs> you know, it's tough. I know. It's okay, though. All right, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. It's all right. So, so look at this verse, King James, verse 16, right? It says, for by him were all things created that are in heaven and that are in earth, visible and invisible, whether they be thrones or domin hold on, dominions or principalities or powers, all things were created by him and for him yes and for him right okay i know right okay no, fair enough. No, you still haven't answered the question bro listen you still haven't answered the question no, that i said no, I, i'm dealing listen bro i'm dealing with the first he born he wants his way right let's move on anyway let's move on you're reading out of context right let's look let's turn to revelation chapter okay. 3 and verse 14. all right it's clear yes, all right I revelation chapter 3 verse 14 reading out just to continue okay right revelation chapter 3 verse 14 okay we'll go there Right, let's just read that. You you find it and read it, please. And let's see what you're going to say to this one. Revelation chapter 3, verse 14. Revelation 3, verse 14 is going to read it. 3.14. Revelation chapter 3, verse 14. What does that say? Right, you're going to read it for us then. Okay. 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 Listen, people. Okay. Finish Jadula. No The same. The yeah, same. Go, yeah, no, just read the, just read the verse, bro. I, I get to. Yeah, but read. Okay. It says in Revelation 3:14. Okay. Revelation 3:14. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Read it. 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 These things say if amen, the faithful and true witness, the beginning of the creation of God. Right, right, okay, stop there. Can I, no, I have so there's, there's a semicolon. Uh, listen, bro, 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 that speaks about, oh, this is what the amen says, yeah? Yeah? That's what it says, yeah? Who is the amen? Jesus Christ, yeah? Is Jesus, is Jesus Christ the amen? Jesus Christ the amen. Yeah, is it the amen? But when he says amen doesn't mean Jesus. Bro, have you got, amen bro, bro, so yeah, but listen. This is, listen, go, go back and look into the scriptures, listen. Is this the scripture here? No, that's 15. Okay. Go down back to 14, let go me go read it. Go back to 14. Go ahead. Right, I'll read any of the versions, right? Right, I'm going to go to um, the, this King, the King James, New King James Version. And to the angel of the church of Laodicea, write, these things say is the Amen the faithful and true witness, the beginning of the creation of God. Who is that? So yes, yeah, so, and to the angel of the church, these things say Says the, the amen. 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 Yeah. The faithful and true witness, <laughs> the beginning of the creation by God, of God. Who is that? Confounded. You see it? You see what I see? What, what, what do you mean? Yeah, but that's a different, bro. No, no, no. Stick to listen. I don't, no, 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 I don't what, what, listen, what? bro, bro, bro. Listen, yeah, bro. I'm looking at the scriptures. I'm not looking at what other people say. The overall scripture okay. calls this amen the beginning of the creation okay, by good. God. Don't, don't, no, sh I don't change. Move away. I won't move yes. Away from now. So, who is that? So, okay. This is talking about. Now, right. Now, listen. So it's just what you've done, Isaiah, is you've taken it out of context. Yeah. That's what I believe. Why have I taken that out of context? That's not. That's not. Listen. That's revelation. Hold on. <coughs> now, we're going to go back to the same verse. We're still in the same verse. We haven't moved anywhere. No, you need to explain that. I am who, is, explain. who is that? I'm, I don't no. need to. I don't. No. I'm not going to no. give you who, a lie. No, bro. Or who is I'm the beginning? I'm going to explain to you based on what the Bible yeah, says. Yeah, but who is the beginning relax, of the creation relax. by God? So you could allow me to respond. Yeah, go on. You go on. Go on. Go on. Go on. Okay. So. If you go to, I mean, you just look at any, just try and get more context. Look what you'll see. It says in Amplified, for example, to the angel, divine messenger of the church, these are the words of the Amen, the trusted and faithful and true witness, the beginning and origin of God's creation. Another, another translation says, write to the angel of the church in Laodicea, Laodicea, sorry, thus says, 
the Amen, the faithful and true witness, the originator of God's creation. Right, so you're just, you're just going from different different books no, which say different things. These guys are scholars. Yeah. Bro, bro, bro. Anyway, so the one who wrote so the one so the one who wrote the one I read, is oh he not that one's gosh. not a scholar, no? Oh my gosh. All right. I'm giving you more context and you're complaining. Yeah, because bro, why. because bro, you're waffling. How? Because you're not you're not, you're not you're not you're not you're not dealing with it. to you. I'm going to give you one more. He's the originator. But, but check, check the original Greek if it's yeah, I I know, I know what the original Greek said, but I'm not going to bother with it. I'm just giving him right. simple, right? I'm going to give you one more, bro. And if you can't if you can't if you can't no, tell no, no, me about no, no. this, bro. You've given one. No. I'll, I'll all right. I'm going to give you one after. Okay. Let me right. Go. So you haven't you haven't fully explained nothing there because you haven't answered my question. The same book right. that you're using, Revelation. I've got a special present. For you. Okay. So go to Revelation chapter three. This is the same chapter. This is going to show you how dishonest. Yahaziah is being. It might not be. I don't want to be too strong and say. But I have been. Maybe bro, it is dishonest. I have but, just or read. Maybe it's just complete bro, negligence. I have just read the scripture, complete, brother. But you are putting meaning into ignorance. scripture. Go to Revelation three. <laughs> God here. You're putting meaning into scriptures. All right. Where are we now? Let's see the evidence. Where, where are we now? Revel that Jesus is a. What, what Revelation is it? What is well, it? This is Revelation three. Revelation three, verse twenty-one. Right, Revelation 3, 21, and it says, To the one that conquers, I will grant to sit down with, with, on my throne, even as I have conquered and sat down with my father on his throne. Okay, Right. so do you believe that a created being can sit on the father's throne? Why not? No, it's a question. Yes. You believe? Yes. So you believe that the Father can sit down? No, that Jesus can sit on the Father's throne. Okay, so you have evidence. Do you have more evidence? Yeah, you want to show you? Yeah, show me. All right. I'll just, I'll just quote it. When Jesus was resurrected, he came back. He said to his apostles, he says, all authority has been given to me in heaven and on earth. Okay. And he's, the scripture tells us that he's going to sit on the throne of God to judge mankind. Oh. oh, you didn't know about so that one. Jesus, oh, that one surprised so you. Jesus is going to sit on the throne of God. Yeah, but because, because is Jesus not king? <laughs> is Jesus not king? And yeah, later on, he's all right, the King of Kings yeah. and the Lord of and God. And later on, later, all right, I'm so sure another scripture. See how he just debunked himself. Wait, so a created being can sit on the throne of God. So, so listen, if God, listen, didn't oh, listen. What did I say? Jesus you said, have "You heard." Yourself. I say it again. Jesus said. All authority has been given to me yeah. in heaven yeah. and on yes. earth. And a created being right. has this kind of Listen, bro, 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 you're listening. You're, yeah, you're listening. Stride himself. Who gave Jesus all this authority? Wait. Did he give it to himself? <laughs> so wait. Bro, ask wait, so, the question, so, bro. Ask so, the question. I'm still waiting. I'm happy bro, to answer the question. Bro, bro, bro. Listen, don't waffle. No, Jesus, bro, listen. The only one doing Jesus the said, bro, is Jesus you, said, you all authority absolute, has been, been given to me really in bro. heaven listen. and on earth. Go therefore and make disciples of all nations, baptizing them in the name of Father, Son, and Holy Spirit. That's why? what he said. Why? But you're saying why? you can't see on his throne. Why? You're bringing right. up verses, all these right. verses. One more verse why? before we finish this why? off. Why? Let's go into the book why? of Daniel. No, wait, wait, no. And step I'm going to show you why step. Jesus got that Jesus step has been given authority. Step, step, by step. the Father. Step by step. So you know, you, you, you don't want to listen. No, you, you said, listen, bro. You said, you, you Admit, admit it. You, you, you got no answer. I've just showed you. You've got no answer, You're bro. You're saying that Jesus is a created being. But he's a created being. Yeah, he's see is. But the scriptures excuse I've told me, you, me, he's the firstborn excuse of all me, creation. Me, You've me, just me, read it me, three me, times, me, bro. You just Trump, said stop denying that the scriptures. a created being yes. is sitting on the Father's throne. Yes. You can't do that. But Je okay, I show you. Is why. Jesus is Jesus is Jesus from heaven? Was Jesus a spirit creature before he came to earth? Angels from heaven. What's your no, was Jesus a spirit okay. creature? Bro, you're you're waffling, bro. bro. Listen, you're waffling, man. You're, you're not you're not talking. You're, you're not talking waffling. sense, bro. You think you're right, but you're. I'm I'm wrong. right because I'm giving you scriptures. Okay, let me There's show one you. more let me I want to give you. Is Jesus? Does Jesus have a head? Does Jesus have anybody over him? Because you're, you're the one. <laughs> you're not even yeah? exegeting the. Yeah, no, this guy, he, he can't take it, can he? I'm going to show you that Jesus is subjective and he has a head. Yeah, someone above him. All right. So it can't be the same if okay, he has someone so, above him. Look at this. 
He quoted Colossians 1, verse 14 and 15. And then, if you read the next verse, it says that Christ created everything. He is the originator of everything. He created it with his own hands. Now, and it was, and not only that, the creation that the Lord Jesus Christ of Nazareth created, it was for him. Now, that's New Testament. So let's let's be intellectually honest, let's be historical, and let's try and look at the evidence in the Old Testament. So when we go to Isaiah 45 verse 12, it says, I have made the earth and created man upon it. I, even I'm not disputing that. I'm not disputing have that. Created out the heavens and all their hosts. I'm not disputing have that. I commanded. I'm not disputing that. So is Jesus part of the host? I'm not disputing that. Jesus part of the host. Bro, am I disputing that? You know yes, that the scripture? No, I'm not disputing you're saying, that. You're saying. Did I say Jesus didn't create anything? I, is Jesus part of the host? I, the, the first scripture I read was in the beginning God said let us make man in our image and he was speaking to the first born of yes, all creation who's speaking in Isaiah 45 verse right. 12 listen, it is you're Yahweh speaking anyway listen wait 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 listen. You, know, you know I'm still on track no, because no, Jesus was there on he's the one that created says, things because God I gave him the power the to do so I created man upon it I even my hands have stretched out the heavens. Who's saying and that? All their Is that Jesus saying that or the Father? That's Yahweh. Right, so That's yeah. the one divine spirit but, of God. But so why in the scripture we read earlier he said, let us make man in our Let's image. Us because God is a triangle. He, he, no, he's not a yes, triangle. He God. No, he's not the a triangle. Father, God. No. The Son, no, and the Holy Spirit. No, no, so no. why does no. this is what I'm saying? Okay, so you need to see a verse right. where I can show you. This is what you need to see, yeah. Yeah. Yazi. Bro, you, you, bro, wait, hold on. Let's finish there now. Listen, gonna, wait, let me just give you one scripture. No. I need to show you a verse. I got one more scripture and you got one more scripture. I need right? to show okay. you a verse. You're just where, waffling, bro. No, no, to me. excuse me, you have to listen. I have to show you a verse where where the father makes it super clear. He does not share his throne. How about that? Would that satisfy you? Well, let's deal with the points because first. Because you believe God, you believe the Most High is just the Father. Is you don't believe there's equality. Yeah. You believe they're not equal. You believe in subordination. Right. Is now, Jesus wanna, equal wanna, to wanna, God? Now I want to make it clear to you. If, if the if I can show you a verse in the Bible which says that God does not share his throne with anyone. Would that be sufficient? So Jesus is that lying when he says all authority has been given to me in no, heaven no, no. and earth. So, you, so why, are you, why are you even quoting that? But is Jesus, but is Jesus lying when he you said that? You don't even believe in the equality. Bro, is Jesus lying when he exactly. said that? Exactly. So if, it, excuse me, if, he's, if he's given you, if he's given Jesus the all power in heaven and earth, we know that it, that verse represents equality with the Father. There's no way God shares his glory with anyone. He doesn't share his glory with any other so, being yeah, according to your analogy. Yeah, yeah, but you're, yeah. So 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 what so so what so Jesus was lying. So so Jesus was lying when he said all authority has been given to me in heaven and earth. Then. You're, you're not even getting it. You're not even getting it. Bro, ask the you're question. Not, was Jesus lying it. when he said all authority always, has been given to me? He he's talking listen. Listen, he's talking about the redemptive plan. When he's, when he's referring to the power, when you're talking about the authority of Christ, he's always had it. So, how can, so if he's always verse, had it, how comes it was... John 17. Yeah, so says, that means he's lying then. No, he says, he says, let me glorify you, the Father, like I had with you in the beginning. Bro, you're not, you're not dealing with the points I'm trying to say to you. You're not you're dealing with it. To, you're trying to Je subordinate Christ. <laughs> And well, you, you don't have the evidence. You're stuck in your Trinitarian so thing, bro. There's no... Tri the yeah. Bible's speaking already, bro. Yeah, bro, but no, but you're stuck in your Jesus Trinitarian understanding. Remember the prayer, the bro. Scriptures is telling us, the Scriptures is telling us completely man, different to what you're saying, bro. Wait, 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 wait. One more script. Listen. Stubborn. Is Jesus subjective? And Jesus... Wait, Jesus done such a fantastic That's my job. question. Is Jesus subjective, bro? Let me, let me just... Is he, is he subjective listen, to anybody? I'll, just hold on. He did such a great job in his in, in the human nature when he manifested on earth. He did such a great job to the point where you actually believe that he was created. That's how humble 
and that's how much of a good enough job the Lord Jesus Christ of Nazareth right. did. Yeah, bro. If Jesus was subjective, now, was Jesus subjective or now, not? Come on, let me speak now, bro. He manifests. Was Jesus question. subjective? What? So, was then Jesus I ask subjective? the question next. Yeah. Was Jesus yeah? subjective I ask the, to God? I ask the question next. Okay. So, to the Father. On earth, on earth, when he manifested in the flesh, on earth, as we see during his earthly ministry, as it says in the book of Philippians, yeah. it's interesting you didn't read that, Philippians chapter 2, it says that he took, it, said, it says that even though he was found in the likeness of God, <laughs> sorry, in the likeness of men, he did not count it robbery to be equal with God. Robbery to be equal with God. Okay? Can I ask the question? So, are you going to so answer I my think question? That is clear. Cut verse yeah, but are you going to answer my question? That shows that's one, that's, that's one verse with context about the yeah, equality you're, you're, of yeah, you're, you're, Jesus you're still waffling. and the Father. No, so, bro, if anyone's waffling, all right. you're waffling. All right, let me go now. Let me go. All right, you're, you're, all right, trying all right. say, you're trying to say right. that Jesus is not equal to the Father. Right. I, I'm saying to you, there's plenty of verses right. that substantiate that. Now, what? I've shown Wait, you're, you're carrying on, bro. Give me a chance, bro. Let no, me no, speak. No, no, it's my turn to ask the question. <laughs> you're just waffling. It's my turn to ask the question. You've asked, but, you, but listen, you haven't said anything yet. You, you, you asked, haven't given no, me a you've, chance. You've asked me questions. Yeah, I'm but asking. You're no, asking but have you answered the question? As I'm, I'm asking the question. Is Jesus subjective? I just answered that. You didn't answer it. What is, just, is it yes or no? I said that he came in the likeness of men. Yeah. Right? Even though he found it equal, even though he didn't see it as robbery, although he's equal with God, right? He laid that aside and pursued the cross. Right, so Jesus is Philippians chapter two. Yeah, but was he subjective or not? Of course. Right. If you take on human limitation to fulfill the redemptive plan, right, okay, he he was supposed to be the perfect example. I asked them, I asked the Muslims um, about you know, who's the best example, Muhammad or Jesus? And I yeah. believe Jesus is the best example. The head of Jesus is God. Him taking on human limitation to be the best example for mankind. Right, okay, let me listen, listen, listen. You've said that, all right. Let's just see that. I'm talking about subjectiveness. Let's look at Colossians, no, Corinthians, 1 Corinthians chapter 3. So, so, my final, listen. No, wait, 1 Corinthians chapter 3 and 11 verse 3. You've asked a lot of questions. No, but you, now it's my, I give her a chance to talk. He's just been talking. I'll talk then, talk. Explain. Right, I want you to do no, this no, one. Don't ask me you a question. Not, no, explain all right, let's look at the scriptures. About. Right, let's no, turn. No, 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 no. Turn. Explain what you're explaining. Right, right. I'm explain. carrying on from the fact that Jesus is subjective to God. Okay, right? explain yourself. Right, okay. Let's turn to and then you take first, Cor first so Corinthians. Take yes. Okay. First Corinthians 11 verse 3. And let me hear you waffle this one away as well. well yeah? If anyone's waffling, it's you. <laughs> yeah, right. First Corinthians 11. If verse anyone's three. waffling, it's definitely you. <laughs> Let's look at first Corinthians 11 verse 3. Yeah, go on. No, no, no. You read it. Bro. All right, you first Corinthians. You're me a question. You're just explaining your position. <laughs> You're gonna have you got a lot of things to you got a lot of things to think about, bro. Think about. Think about. Yeah, I've got a lot of things to do. Think right? about. What, what, think about what, when you say think right. about. In your, right. In your. In right. your. Right. First Corinthians 11 verse rebuttal, 3 says this. What I have to think about. Right. First Corinthians 11 verse 3. Mm. Right. This is what it says. But I would have you know that the head of every man is Christ. The head of the woman is the man. The head of Christ is God. And every man praying or prophesying, having his head covered, dishonors his head. Yeah, that's why it goes on the 14. But the main one is verse 3. The head of every man is Christ. The head of every woman is the man. The head of Christ is God. Right, so can Jesus be the head of himself? Confounded. So are you explaining or what are you doing? I'm just asking you, no, you can answer it. asking questions, but you're not explaining, no, but, you're not exegeting, but, you're not doing but, anything. But it's saying to me there, because I'm doing scriptures, isn't it? It says no, there, more context. Jesus has got a head, yeah? That's what he's saying. It says the man has got a head in the church, okay. yeah? Yeah, who's Christ? Christ himself has got a head. 
Yeah, who is God? That's what it says. So the head of Christ is God. And when you say God, are you talking about the Father? Are you talking about the Holy Spirit? Are you talking about the Son? Right, so who is God ahead of Christ? This guy, he doesn't, he doesn't explain anything. You're just, you're the one doing the waffling. Exegete what you're saying. Exegete. That's what, that's what Paul is saying. The head of Christ is God. Okay, right. Okay, good, 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 good. Okay. Now, in what context? Now, is he subjective or not? In what context? Is Jesus subjective These to guys, God? man, they, they come with verses. They don't exegete. Well, explain they it, bro. They don't explain anything. They want other people to explain it. You explain it to them. All right, I can explain that one. Just, just panicking you. I can explain that one. Don't worry, man. I, I, maybe explain I'm your it. Bible teacher today. <laughs> Yeah, but I wanted to explain that one before no, we go. You're supposed to. You're the one coming with the verse. You, you should explain. Yeah, but yeah, but, but, but what? I'm but, not explaining. I'm just reading what the scripture says. So you should be. I'm asking the question: Is Jesus objective? Yes. yes but and you're waffling, saying blah blah blah. blah. Give it so a waffle this one. What you're saying Christ. It doesn't say. It doesn't bro, say. If anyone's waffling. Bro, I keep saying bro, this. But it the says there, Christ again, has got a head. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So Who is the head of so Christ? Is that what you believe? You believe Christ has a head. Well, they, well, I'm, I'm not going against the scripture. That's what the scripture this is says, the same bro. Christ that sits on the Father, Father's throne. Yeah, because he's got authority. The Bible says he's given authority. Okay, so that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to show. Was you Jesus first. given authority? Let me just stick with this. First Corinthians three. You're going to allow me to okay, ask on. you a question. Yeah, go on. But I'm going to. You still don't answer no, nothing. You've you haven't given nothing straight. Oh man. You, you, you can't even substantiate your claim. But you haven't even you haven't that. even All answered you can this do question, is point bro. To the order. Anyway. All right. Go on. Verse again. First Corinthians eleven verse three, and the question was: Is Jesus subjective? I know my religion. I know your religion. You don't know your religion. Okay. So. First Corinthians, okay. First Corinthians 11, verse 3. Eleven, verse three. Okay. That's okay. Then you take it in context. Eleven, verse three. So you're gonna have to look at commentary on it, yeah? What commentary? I'm giving you scriptures, yeah. So you're looking at you're gonna look at commentary. What commentary? I don't know. You see any commentary? No. Anyway, you you go on. <laughs> Just explain it. Okay. Anyway. All right. So. What we see, okay, so uh, 1 Corinthians 11 says, Be ye followers of me, even as I am also of Christ. Now I praise you, brethren, that you remember in all things and keep the ordinances as I delivered them to you. That's not verse 3, bro. I am reading verse 3. I'm, I'm reading the context. It says, But I would have you know that the head of every man is Christ, and the head of the woman is the man, and the head of Christ is God. Every man praying or prophesying, having his head covered, dishonoreth his head. Okay. Is that, is, is, is that all you want me to read? Yeah, I just wanted to explain that then, isn't it? The head, because I'm, I'm, I'm asking the question, is Jesus subjective or is Jesus the same? Is he just himself? He, he shouldn't be, if he's the same, as he shouldn't be subjective, should he? So we know the reason why Christ was um, praying to the Father. Okay, it's not that Jesus isn't divine or is not God. That was to be an example for us. So when we read, um, but is Jesus subjective? That's my question, bro. Come on, ask the question. Hold on, hold on. Just, just. You're just explaining on everything Earth, away. I already said to you. I already said to you. Yeah, I said that in terms of. Um, how can we, how can we talk about that? When we talk about the relationship between the Father and the Son, we know He humbled Himself right. to be a perfect example for us. But is He subjective? Okay? And that part of that example, if, if you want to use the word subject, was to show us how to have a relationship with the Father. It doesn't mean that He is subordinate. If, if you want to even say subordinate, if you want to say humble, um, or should we say, like we say, uh, he took on human flesh. If you want to kind of say that, uh, and he was living life, as we know, during his earthly ministry, to, to, to be that um, sacrifice that we know he ended up being, I'm okay with that. So on earth, Jesus wasn't 
on earth Jesus was a lesser God. Lesser God? No, who yeah. said lesser God? Where's that verse? Well, if he's subjecting now, to uh, uh, someone show else. Show me the verse where you just said lesser God. Show me the verse. No, I have to show you the verse. I'm trying you to. Do. No, I'm just. I'm just. You can't just say things I'm just, anyway. and not back up what you're saying. All right, okay. You said lesser God. You still God. haven't answered the question, in, bro. That's what's in your mental model. Yeah, because your, your mental, mental model, model is Trinitarian is, model. No, no. Your mental and, model is that. Bro. Jesus on earth was a lesser but God. Jesus is subjective. But did that scripture but did that scripture that I showed you show Jesus to be subjective or not? Show me the Bible first. Okay, well again people he has not show me been the Bible able first that he's to a lesser defend God. it. So I'm gonna I'm gonna go on to one more last thing and okay, then we're gonna so, call it so, an end. So this is the problem with, with Unitarians. They say I told you I'm biblical, yeah? But they never substantiate what they say. And you cannot answer questions, bro. Evidence. I already explained to you, and it's like. You I'm haven't explained to anything. Do you have, have you understand all the things you've said? Of, of, Does it listen, make any sense? Just, listen, <laughs> listen. <laughs> listen. But anyway, you, you know, in Corinthians. You said lesser God. Yeah, that, like, yes, I, I'm actually going to pinpoint you on that one. You said lesser God. I'm asking you, I was Wait, asking you the question. Me any verse in the Bible. Bro, I'm asking yeah. you the question. You gotta answer yes no, or no. I'm is he not a he's a lesser God? Is he equal to God? The spirit that was in him was uncreated. But is Jesus so, but equal? My question to you is you explain to me where in scripture Jesus is referred to as a lesser God. Show me. Well, I don't believe Jesus Show is God, me. bro. I don't, have to, I don't have to show you that, exactly. but I'm going to show you another screen. Because, because you, you can't, you, you, you cannot not, substantiate Jesus your is claim. subjective, that means he's lesser. If Jesus, Jesus is God, he's subjective to, his, to the Father. Says, okay, Why show did me you? the verse that proves he's lesser. Show All right, okay. Show me. All right then. Show me. <laughs> show me <laughs> he's not going to accept this one now. All right. That proves that. All right, I'll show you. Wait, I'll show you. I'll show you. The divinity of Christ, okay, is lesser. Uh, Jesus said, "My God." The essence, the essence of Christ. What's changing? What's changing? It's asking a different question. You're changing the question. What? How did I change it? No, he's asking a specific question. No, how did I change it? No, but you said divinity. Is he asking about divinity? So he's talking about essence, is he not? He never said that. I didn't say that. Didn't say yes. okay. so, if you're not talking about essence, why would you have the impression that Jesus is a lesser God? No, 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 don't help him. He said lesser God. Did, you, did he say that? Yes or no? Okay, so what does he mean? So I have to ask him. And that's why I'm trying to tease out of this guy. But he's just completely all over the place. Look, look at him. Look at him right now. I can only be chatting with no, what can I do, man? No, no, so anyway, anyway, you, so, you know the scripture that says, me, yeah, I go to my God and your God. Yeah, yeah so find, it, God find God, it first. So that's find objective. It, find it first. Right, okay, let me find it. It's in John, yeah. So you're saying your translations are not reliable. Okay. Gibran is not the Holy Spirit. Okay, so I want to read something. I've got a question for you, but I'm going to read something. Whilst you're looking. It says in John 14, verse 27 to 28, it says, Peace I leave with you, my peace I give unto you. Not as the world give, it, give I unto you. Let not your heart be troubled, neither let it be afraid. Ye have heard how I said unto you, I go away and come again unto you. If ye love me, you would rejoice, because I said I go unto the Father. I'm helping you, don't worry. For my Father is greater than I. So that's and it the, says, yeah. and now I have told you before it comes to pass, and when it has come to pass, hereafter, I will not talk much of you, for the prince of the world come and have nothing. But the world may know that I love the Father, and as the Father ga gave me the commandment, even so I do, arise, let us go then. The Father gave okay. him the commandment. I helped you find the verse. No, yeah, no, I'm fine. No, 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 no. Anyway, you should, so, you should be thankful. So who gave Jesus the commandments? You should be, ha you should be happy. <laughs> you should be happy. Anyway, my you. final scripture is this no, 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 one. No, no, wait, hold on, hold on. Let oh, me finish, let me finish. Go on, then. I've got one more scripture, that's all. Let me we call it a day. Okay, so I helped you then. So. Now, verse 23 of John 14. Go on. See, we don't hide anything. We don't have to hide anything. Yeah, yeah. Look what it says in John 14, verse 23. Jesus answered and said unto him, If a man love me, he will keep my words. Yeah. Okay. 
and my father will love him that's right yeah and we will come on to him and make our abode with him yeah so, yeah so a created being wherever someone asks for prayer jesus can be there but jesus has been all authority bro and jesus was in heaven jesus from heaven isn't he is jesus from heaven relax, relax, relax. jesus is the son of god the first of creation right okay my scripture wait, now. wait 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 let me finish let me finish because i know you're you're trigger happy man you want to jump to another <laughs> no jump it's trigger happy as you i've got one more scripture for you okay because you haven't answered none of them bro you just waffle around go on what do you mean by waffling? Well, you're waffling around here, you're just tell coming me, up with me, different... Tell me what you mean by waffling. What are you doing? You're doing, you're going from here to there, jumping to here to there and saying this was what it all means. No, well, I've already, I said to you, you asked me, you made a point about subordination. I said that he manifested in the flesh for a purpose. Yeah. Alright, overall, could you, could you say that Jesus is subjective then to God? I already said that on earth. So he's subjective on earth. No, when I, on earth, hmm. right, he was... Like I said, he laid aside his divine prerogatives, as we see in Philippians 2. Yeah. And he was obedient to the Father. Right, so he was as subjective. It says in Philippians 2. So when he was on earth, he was subjective. Yes. He but he's not God, but he's not God on earth because he's sub negates his divinity. Okay. So when he's on earth, right, I'm gonna get straight. I, when he's on earth, he is now subjective to someone. So obedient to the father right so he's subjective it's not a word you find in the bible but he it's said i do the will of my father not my will exactly yeah so he, did, he didn't exactly. do his will he did the will of the father so therefore he's subjective no, he did, he did his, no. <laughs> the scripture on, says on. i do my he, your... he, yes he followed his father's will so okay. when he's on earth he's subjective so subjective now so that means he's Maybe subject to god semantics is obedience good enough for you? Yeah, but, he, but is obedience good. But he was in subjective God. I'm just saying, maybe it's semantics. But was it a subjective? You're using subjective. But let's say. So the scripture. Maybe it's. Yeah, like bro, I said, bro, maybe bro. semantics. Yeah, but it's not semantics because is it, Paul are you said. With Paul said. Are you Paul said his head, Jesus' head, what? is God. That means that Jesus is subjective to God. Jesus okay. prayed to God. Okay. That means Jesus is subjective to God. So you Jesus, Jesus is doing you the believe, will of you God Jesus because he's subjective to God, to God in heaven. Do you believe he was subjective to God in heaven? But of course he was. Okay. Do you believe he's still subjective to God in heaven? Right now, not at the moment he isn't because he's been given authority. God said he's been wait, given wait, authority. Wait, 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 wait. Until what a certain exactly time. What exactly is your point then? Well, if, I'm trying to tell you no, that no, Jesus. If he is subjective. Yeah. To the Father, which means he's subordinate. So who's going to rule the Who's going to rule the kingdom for a thousand step years? By step, step, by <laughs> step, step by step. Step by step. So you know you're. Bro, bro. You, know you don't know your Bible, bro. You're falling into your own trap. No, you don't yes, know you your. Have. You don't yes, know you your Bible, bro. So you said that on earth he was like you kept using the words. I tried to help you. I said there's you other words. Help me, bro. Said, you need okay. to help yourself, bro. Okay, I won't help you. <laughs> no, now me. you said, you said that Jesus was subject to the Father. On yeah, earth. he's been subject. And I asked you the question. Is he subject to the Father in heaven? And you said no. What do you mean I said no? Okay, of course so he is. He's subject to, if I said that, I must have misplayed. But he is subject uh, to the Father in heaven. So he's subject to the Father in heaven. But he's not, see, okay. when, oh, you mean when he's in heaven or when he's on earth? Do you mean when he's in heaven, is he subject this to the Father? Boy, man. Right, wait. Listen, wait, listen. Tell me what you mean. Do you mean that he's subjective? In the, you, do you mean that is he subjective when he's in the heaven with the Father? Or do he's subjective when he's on the earth? Which one do you mean? Tell me. Okay, you already established. Yeah. And I already said that when he was on earth, he was subjective. He yeah? was obedient to the Father. So he was you subjective. Like to say on subjective. earth, yeah, yeah. All right, but it's subjective. Whatever, yeah, whatever. Yeah. Obedience means subjective, if you look yeah, at it. Okay, let's, let's yeah. Yeah, we'll go with your thing. Yeah, yeah go on. Now, my question is is that replicated in heaven? Right. Is he. Right, okay. Me, one second. Yeah, go on. I want you to get this. In heaven, is he subordinate to the Father? Right, let me tell you what I said again. I'm going to repeat what I said. I said, Jesus said, all authority has been given to me. He's still subject to the Father, but he's got all authority in heavens and earth, according to the scriptures. Okay, so the subordination that you're implying or inferring mm. is temporary? Yes. Okay. No, 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 no. What I'm saying is, listen, 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 let me tell you what I'm saying. Yeah, 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 let me tell you, yeah, yeah. Listen. No, 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 listen, no. Bro. Yeah, 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 he's so, yeah, yeah. He's so no, passionate, no, 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 let me no. tell you what I'm saying. Listen, Jesus, Go on. who's gonna rule the kingdom for a thousand years? 
You don't understand that. Bro. Oh, I don't, you don't understand, understand that. Verse. Anyway, you, you Jesus is going to rule the kingdom okay, for so a thousand so years and hand it back to God. I know. I he's understand. Gonna, he's gonna, I, understand. I understand it because he says Go on. he's going to rule the kingdom for a thousand years. Then he's going to give it back to God, and then he's going to subject him, and God is going to be sub to everything. So he's going to be subjected. No, no, no. Yes, it does. Anyway, that's that's the point. So the, the the fact is, brother. Yeah. Wait, wait, wait. You wait. can't. Let's go, no, step by step. Yeah. Step by step. Yeah. Don't run My go now. I'm not running away. Don't run You're going to run away after this one. Don't run away, bro. Yeah. Otherwise. But otherwise, here, this, here we go. Don't, bro. Here we go. Listen, here we go. Listen. listen. You yeah. have clearly Jesus run said. Away. Jesus you said. You haven't answered one question. Jesus, I'm glad this guy's camera is here. Okay. Jesus okay. said. Okay. Yeah, he stopped okay. touching wait, wait, me. Wait. Bro, bro, bro. Right? Yes, I am. Stop touching me, he says. Be on your way, Yosiah, my brothers, and say honest. to them, so I, can't talk I to am ascending to my Father, I can't talk to and this your one. Father, and my you God, and your God. That is Yosiah, subjective. You have shown dishonesty, because you want to run away now. All right, okay, okay. You haven't, you haven't stood your ground. I rest my case, bro. You haven't stood your ground to take another question from me. You think you're correct, right? I said to you, is he subordinate? in heaven what did i say and you're saying what exactly are you saying is he, sub <laughs> is he subordinate <laughs> in heaven is he subordinate in heaven did i tell you, you that all authority, you been given all to authority is. is given on to him yeah that's what he said okay he so, said that. so does it stop what so yeah, when, it does when, stop one time when because when he's when he said he hands the kingdom back over to god and all things he'll, he'll be all, god will be all things for everybody okay. yeah, i'm going to show you that scripture okay so you're saying to me this is interesting so you're saying, right, mm. that a created being yeah. is inheriting or, or literally taking. God gave no, God gave him authority. Gave him authority. Okay, and so it tells you if you look at if you look at Daniel chapter seven, it tells you that Jesus was brought up before him and he was given I the authority. I have no problem with that verse because oh, yeah. it represents equality. No, I have it no represent problem. Doesn't represent equality. Nothing. But the thing, it's you think it's subordination. It is, but it is. It is. And subordination. Extends but Jesus is to the Father. The subordination extends bro. to Jesus sitting on the throne of the Father. If you're God, you can't be subjective okay, to yourself. So bro. does the kingdom of and this is where he falls down. Does the kingdom of Jesus ever end? The kingdom will not end because it says it's a kingdom that will last forever. But Jesus Wait, is gonna hand it back no, to no, God. No, 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 no. You know, Jesus okay, is gonna so hand the kingdom back kingdoms, to God. How many kingdoms are there? Do you know Jesus is gonna hand the kingdom back to God? How Shall I show kingdoms, the scripture? How many kingdoms are there? What do you mean how many kingdoms are there? Guess God's kingdom. So is Jesus' kingdom gonna last forever? Listen, God. Listen, what? <laughs> listen, let me explain to you. Okay, explain that. This is what happened. Explain. Jesus said, authority. Okay. Listen, Jesus said, all authority has been given to me on heaven and on earth. Yes. The reason he said that is because he's gonna sit on the throne to judge us down here before Armageddon comes, where he's going to return with his angel to destroy the wicked, yeah? Which no, is written in Revelation. Uh, right, anyway, no. anyway, I'm just telling you're you what the Bible says. No, no, I'm just telling you what the Bible says. And listen, and it says a thousand years as it have to pass, and after the thousand years, Jesus will hand the kingdom back to God. <laughs> you have to show the scripture. You don't even understand what You have to show the scripture, all right. What are you talking about? Listen, man. Rubbish. This is the Bro. thing. You, you're, you're having a, a tough time. The thing is, you need He's to. Telling I'm having you, a tough time. No, but you need to reread. Bro, that. I've read it, bro. I know okay. what it says. So, okay, okay. That's what it says. So, yeah, and you're going to put rec your own twist on it. Okay. Reconcile. Reconcile how you can have a kingdom that does not end like Jesus. Right. Like you said, all authority has been given unto him. Yeah. Reconcile how that kingdom has no end yet. You're saying Jesus hands it back. Right, okay. Right, let me show you let me show, so, show you a so scripture. Explain to me, does yeah. he still have the authority, yes or no? Yeah. But 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 does Jesus yeah man, does Jesus say does Jesus, right? You're asking me a question. Am I, yeah, because I, I, want, I want you to answer the but, question. Yeah. Sorry, man. Yeah. I want you to answer the question. Yeah. Go ahead. The kingdom. I've already told you, I've answered that question already. No. That Jesus hands back the kingdom no. to God. So if so. And that's what the scripture says. So the scripture's wrong. I'm, I, what I'm trying to say to you, what I'm trying to ask you, to ask you, he has a kingdom that lasts forever. Yes, earthly kingdom. And he has authority no, that was given no, to him. No, you know, the, you know what the kingdom's talking about? You know what the kingdom's so talking about? It's talking me. about the kingdom on the earth. That's what it's talking about. Okay, show the book. Right. So okay, you're saying, I'm going to show him so you're the kingdom that the Jesus is going to rule over. That's what they're talking about. What did Jesus preach? 
the kingdom of God, didn't he? Alright, right, I'm going to show so you. Where's the kingdom of God? What do you mean where's the kingdom of God? It's ruled by heaven, but it's going to be on the earth. Oh my. Alright, let me this show you. It's the worst eschatology <laughs> I've ever heard in my life. You don't know this, did you? You didn't know no, this, no, no, did you? No, no, what you're saying does not... It, 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 you well, I'll show you, bro. It, it don't make sense. It but doesn't ahead. make sense show, to you. Show, show, show. Show it doesn't us. make sense to you because you're a Trinitarian and you as haven't you, got the understanding. Yeah, exactly. As you, as you're looking for it. Jesus says... Let's go to verse 18 of John 14. It says, I will not leave you comfortless. I will come to you. How does Jesus do that? Only God can do that. Only God can be everywhere at the same time. Only God can leave you in comfort. Leave you not comfortless. Only Jesus can do that. In John 14. So, that verse. Right, let's look at 1 Corinthians 15, 24. Right, so I've got, I've got a question. Yeah, 1 Corinthians 15, 24. Let's read that. Right, so it's my turn. Now. Yeah, go on, you read that. 1 Corinthians 15, 24. All right. I've got a question for you, mate. All right, let me read wait, it. Wait, wait, so what are we doing here? What are we doing here? Well, we're because carrying on with what I've I said. I can, I can do other things. At because, the end, yeah. Let's, because because right. you, can't, you can't stand here. Okay, I'm, I'm giving you... you on tape yeah, yeah. to show the kind of person you are. Right, okay, fine. You can't stand here and just ask questions okay. and not answer anything. All right, okay. So are you prepared to answer a question? Yeah, in a yes minute after I've said this No, 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 because yeah, you've already been asking questions. Yeah, bro. but anyway, let me are read you, the scripture. Wait, yeah, prepared, I'll answer, yes, yes. Are you yes. prepared right now yes. to ask a question? Yes, yes. Okay. Let me read this first. No, 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 you don't need to read anything. And then the end comes when he hands over the kingdom right. to God to and the, the Father oh, and he oh, destroyed oh, all dominion, authority Hebrews and one. power. Who is that? Hebrews 1. You want to play dirty? Bro, I'll give you a scripture, a bro. I'm giving you a scripture. You're playing, you're beat, you're that shows that Jesus like hands a, the kingdom back to the like bro. Who's not But Jesus, no, Jesus hands back the kingdom. That's what the Bible says. This is the thing. The end will come when he I, hands over the kingdom to God, the Father, and after he has destroyed all dominion, okay. authority, and power. That, Who is that? That's, that's Jesus. Question. Is that your question? No, that's not my question. I'm just showing you okay, good. what I was saying before that Jesus hands over. 24. Okay. And that negates his essence. <clears throat> that's interesting. No, no. I'm okay. just telling you right. about. It all, all what I'm saying, I'm backing it up with scripture. Good, good, good. Yeah, good. okay. All right, so Hebrews. So Jesus hands the kingdom back over, yeah? That's Hebrews what, one. yeah. Does the Father call Jesus God? Does the Father call Jesus God? Yeah, yeah, he would, he would refer to him as God. Okay, so if he's referring. But he doesn't call him Almighty oh, okay, God, does so he? How many gods? Are there. Right. Do you do you know the word God means is just a title? Do you know that? So I listen. Do you know the word God is just a title though? You're not you're, you know <laughs> bro, bro. is um, bro, bro. Do you know the word God is new, just a title, don't you? Do you know when you're gonna call God you're gonna call him by his name? Listen. His name is Jehovah or Yahweh. Okay. Do, we, yeah? do you wanna go to the interlinear? Yeah. But that's what God's name is. They removed it from the Bible, yeah? Oh, so you believe the Bible's corrupted? No, but the names have been removed because of superstition. Do you know that? Excuse me. Excuse do you know that the God? Me, do you know that the Bible, the name of God was in seven hundred? This is what I'm saying, guys. This guy an angel in disguise. Nothing, bro. He's an angel. You're he's no, an angel in disguise. No I promise bro. you. Listen to me, man. Are you saying to me the Bible is, is, is um, has been corrupted? Listen, I didn't say that. Did I? All I said to you, God's That's name has been removed due to superstition. All right, let me show you. The scribes. They removed the name of God. All right, let me show you. The From the seventh. Oh, I'll show you. Guys, look at this guy. This guy, right? Galatians one verse eight talks about. Let me show you, bro. If any man preach any other gospel, let him be accursed. Here we go. Accurse me. Here we go. Accurse me. Let me show you that the Bible's you. name. God's you. name removed from the Bible. You're, you're preaching a completely different gospel. <laughs> you're saying the name of God is removed. Let me read it. No, no, it's okay. The name Yahweh is missing from many Bible translations for a variety of reasons. That means they were there Give before. Give me a Bible. The Jewish, bro. 
the Jewish tradition of speaking God's name out of respect of one reason okay. why some Bible translations they use the As word see, Lord instead of Yahweh he's the going outside of the Bible the Greek translation of the Hebrew scriptures so God's name has been removed by, from the scripture brother what are, you, what are you talking about? what do you mean what am I talking about? it's there, it's written it's written so, so they've removed the name of God from the Bible which okay, is that what, name okay, Yahweh, and they've put Yahweh, it in listen, I'll read, I'll say bro, read it okay, so read it where? where? God's where name what's God's was name? It where was it's it? removed from all the places that it were bro don't, don't waffle it's, it's don't me give me philosophy show bro you know you, you can't show you, 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 you know you're lost what? don't you what you you know you're lost don't you bro you lost from the moment bro you're gonna give up bro you said you is God's name removed from the bible when Jesus was created <laughs> that's when you lost bro bro you, by the way, you've by the lost way, by the you've way. lost so the question because is I've just read to you that they removed the name of God from the bible what does that mean and they've put Lord what does that mean where so, so the God has a name where is it from all the places that it's supposed to be they've made they've replaced it where with the name God Lord where? all through where everywhere <laughs> everywhere okay, from 7,000 right. places anyway, they removed my question it. to Thank you. you my question to you was was did did the father call Jesus God yes, can I ask you a question I will, yeah, I'll, I'll ask take him a it, question I'll take it I yeah. he, he's gonna go quiet and it doesn't surprise me right my, my question <laughs> did the you father you're saying I'm, I was quiet all, 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 all no, no, I'm saying you're going to go quiet. quiet with this question. How many gods? Listen, I know what the scripture says. Okay. He called him, yeah. But you know the word, what I'm okay. trying to say to you, okay. that the word God, the word God, yeah, in the Bible, they've got a small God and they've also got a big God in the Bible, yeah? Explain this. All right, God. so listen, 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 God. listen. Yeah, yeah. So, where the name were, the real name of God were, the YHWH, they've made that big God, yeah? And in the smaller one, they made a small God. So it's been corrupted in that way. But, listen. Jesus, so listen, what, what, listen, what, what, wait, wait, let me finish. Let me finish, bro. Go ahead. Right. Quick, just quick. So, the word God is not the name of God. The name God is not the, the name, name of God. God. No. So in the Greek, the word God, I said, the word God is not the name of God. Like, 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 is it? Okay. So in the in your Greek, how we understand who the Father is? Yeah. But the word what's God the, is, bro, bro, bro. The, okay. ro, the so word. Listen the, to what I'm saying. The so word the God me. is not the name of God. So where the name of God should be, they've put down the word God. Okay. Every, but it's not referring okay. to every, it, so it mixes people up. But every description of God that we have today. Yeah is a construct of human language anyway. Yeah. So my question is, is the father who we see in the New Testament, are you saying to me that there is no word to describe that that is the actual Right, when father? you say the father, he is the true, only true God, the father. Yeah. And so, you, do you know that, listen, do you know that the scripture, listen, is Satan okay. God Almighty? Just wait. Just wait, 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 is Satan God? You asked me a question, let me read. I'm because the scriptures say question. Satan is God. Let's finish, let's finish this properly. Let's, let's the scriptures say Satan is relax, God. Relax. We'll look at that in a minute. Hebrews chapter one, this is my question for you. Yeah, go on. Did, did the father call Jesus God? Yeah, 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 yeah he did. Yeah. Yeah, so yeah. you admit that? That's yes, good. yes, yes. And does Jesus have divine origins? Jesus come from heaven. He came from heaven. But he's subjective. Okay, right. So he can so, be called a God. Okay, you can so say. you say subjective. So do you mean that, do you believe Jesus, like obviously we as, cre as created beings, we can change. Do you believe Jesus has changed? Changed to what? In terms of his nature. What do you mean his nature? What? what, from a human being? Just in general, just Jesus, his, right, right. who he is. You haven't been is. listening all this time we've been talking. No, no, it's not about, you, look, just don't, don't try, don't. When Jesus was on earth, he was a human, was he? Do Wasn't believe, he not? Do you believe that the um, the authority of Christ, yeah. the essence of Christ, has always been the same? Do you believe that? Right. All right. Let me explain. Let me. Yeah. Listen. I understand. When about the Jesus was on earth, I that yeah. Listen. I know, your I know yeah. what you're going to say. So yeah. when Jesus yes, was yes. on earth, yes. what was he? Like I said. He wasn't a spirit, was he? He had, okay, we'll get, in, in fact, let's, let's deal with that. He wasn't a spirit, was he? So, he when was, was on earth. so what we believe. I know what you believe, go, get on. Believe. go on, go on, you carry, all right, no, I don't know, you go on, you tell me. The spirit that was inside of Jesus, mm -hmm. do you believe it's created or uncreated? It's God's spirit, isn't it? Is it created? It's God's power. It's from God. That spirit inside of Jesus. It's from God. 
The same way you have yeah, Are you talking about the Holy Spirit? Are you talking about his life force? I'm, I'm, I'm talking about his essence. So his life force you're talking about? The essence, the thing that makes him... A human? Not a human. Right. Right, let me tell you what I believe so, then. So, so. Right. Let me tell you what I believe. Yeah, you I believe, know what you're saying. You believe, okay. Because you understand body, soul, spirit. Yes. Okay. Right, let me show you. Yeah, let so me tell you. Yeah. spirit mm -hmm. of Christ. What, yeah. Do you believe that's the... That's right. the bit I want to... I think we've been going here and there, but okay. I think this is the crux. Okay. We, we've actually met at, right. in the right way. All right, let me explain. So, so, so that spirit in Christ. Let me explain, yes. Which is what we refer to as one's essence. Right, you refer to as essence. That's what you refer to. You Trinitarians refer to it no, as that. John 4, 24. So. Right, but, is, yeah. okay, anyway, but anyway, anyway. So let me answer your question. of Jesus yeah. is that created or uncreated right okay the spirit of god yeah as i said to you before in the beginning wait let me finish let me finish let me explain in the beginning i cre i said to you from the beginning yeah for that jesus right at the beginning as a human being it was in heaven first as a spirit yeah now let's go this is where the holy spirit comes in when jesus was on earth he did not express any godly powers or anything until he was baptized and the holy spirit came down upon him right did he am i wrong just finish, finish, finish. right so i'm just so jesus when he was baptized that's when the holy spirit came down upon him and then that he was he, he, he was empowered then yeah so jesus is now ready to do his commission but the power of god came upon him and that's the spirit. His life from in, in a, from when he was a, from when he was in heaven, God transfer his very being spiritually into the woman. The life force of him was yeah. in the woman that made Jesus what he is. And but Jesus, when he it's not until he was baptized that he received the power of God. You know when you say life force, you know, it's this, life force. Yeah. This sounds like Jehovah Witness. No, 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 no. But no, no. So, listen. Do you know that we all have a, you know what, you know Where'd when- you get life force from? All right, not call it life force, call it his spirit then. His life spirit. Okay, so- His life spirit. So, so once again, you're talking about when Jesus was in the flesh, okay? You're talking about him being baptized. My question to you is a simple one. Do you believe- That's when he became thing. That's when he became powerful. When, yeah, when, when me, listen, when Adam, me, when, listen, let me explain. When Jesus blew, when Jesus so blew into the, no, when Jesus blew into, when Jesus created man from the dirt, what made that man animated? Okay, good. You believe Jesus actually created something? Okay. God, yeah, no, well, yeah. All right, cool. I, did, I didn't say that he didn't like create God, nothing. No. God, when, the, when, one uh, listen, but, anyway. but God said, let us. So there was more yes, than exactly. one. So he was speaking, so he wasn't speaking, so God wasn't, yeah, but he wasn't speaking to himself. Because if you're going to speak, if you're the same thing, you wouldn't be speaking to yourself. Bro. You, you're thinking bro. of human No, no, but yeah. But you're anyway, like a human being. when God blew anyway, the spirit into, the, into the, Adam, the, the Adam became a, a, a living being. Adam talking. became a living being, bro. When God sprung into him, yeah? That's the spirit of God being blown into okay. him. Now. Yeah? So that's what I'm saying. Oh, so right. understand okay. that. So the spirit. Yeah, the spirit is a life force. Yes. The spirit of Jesus. Yeah, his life force. Uncreated. His life force. He's uncreated. It comes from God, doesn't it? it come, God gave him that, that life. Okay. So, compared to you, the life force that's in you, I want to use your own word. Just the breath of life I've got. Wait. Okay, so, are you created or uncreated? No, I've just got the breath of life. I haven't got all the spirit, I've just got your the breath spirit, of life. Is it created or uncreated? No, it's all from God. It's the breath of life that came from my mother. Okay, so is it created or uncreated? It comes from God. So, is it created? Well, if it comes from God, it can't be created, can it? Okay, so you're, so now you're, okay, so are you saying to me that your spirit man, yeah. are you saying to me that is created? Yeah. What? Your, your spirit man, are you saying that's right. created? Right, did God create Adam and Eve? Guys, this guy's, you're, you're going all around the bush, answer, bro. You're not answering the question. 
What do you mean? Why, why, why are you I can't I'm, stand it? Okay, are what you, are you saying? I'm asking you a question. You, you're, you've got yeah, a body. Yeah. You believe in a body. Yeah, and I've got the spirit of you've life. Got a soul. The spirit of life that's been blown you've into. Got a soul. Me. Do you believe you've got a soul? And yes, I've got a soul, which is my, which is God's, which is God's power in me, in a sense that He blew the life force into me. Your soul is your mind, emotions, and no. your will. God blew the life force no, into Adam and Eve, about. didn't He? Didn't God move into them? When did, when did Adam and Eve live? When did Adam live? Was it after he just made him and left him or did he blow into him like? Every life? human being has a human soul. But God blew that into the man. I'm not disputing. Right, so that's I'm what I'm saying. I'm not disputing the way with which, yeah. okay, the soul and the spirit. Yeah. But it comes from God, doesn't it? You know. But it's come it from God. Yeah, the life does. force. So that's the life I'm force. I'm not disputing that. Yeah. So what are you okay. saying? Now, the soul is distinct or not even the The soul is different to the spirit. Do you agree? Is it? Explain it then. I don't know. I don't. I didn't think that. I didn't know that. Tell me. Ah, so you also okay. nah. so, so you the soul is different from the spirit. So explain the difference. So are you saying that you think you believe that they're the same? Right. This is what I believe. This here is my soul. This, all of this, all of this is soul. All of this. But my soul is animated. This is a soul. Do, do animals have a soul? Yes. Show me the scripture. Animals have a soul. Yes. <laughs> you don't know. You don't know the scripture. I'll show you. <laughs> oh, boy. Animals have. As a soul. Have a soul. Okay, I'm going to help you. They have a soul. Listen, no need to. Let me get the scripture. Go get it. Go get Let me get it. it. Yeah, but the point, guys. This is the point. Let me show you. I'll, I need to ask this guy. What's the difference between animals and humans? Then? Do you believe in the Big Bang? Wait a minute. I don't know. I don't know what this guy believes in. But anyway, I thank God for this because this is going to show people the plight of Unitarianism. This guy is struggling to answer a simple question. Right, let's look at Genesis. Um, guy is struggling to answer a simple question. Let's look at Genesis 1, 24 and 25. Is the human is the human spirit created or uncreated? Genesis 1, 24 and 25. Let's read that, shall we? Okay, I'm happy to go there, but my primary question because of time. No, I'm talking about the animals' souls, isn't it? I'm trying to show to you that the animals have souls. You don't want to do it? Let's go. What's the book? Right, look at... Um... All right, it's gone now. to answer my question, though. Is the human spirit created or uncreated? That's what I need an answer for. I don't, I'm not really bothered about any other question. question. Sure, um, I don't know, the, I've lost the verse I was going to, but it's Genesis 1, 24, I think it is. But here, you know, Ecclesiastes, surely the faith of human being is that of animal. The same fate awaits both of them. As one dies, the other dies. All have the same breath. Yeah? Human have no advantage over animal. Everything is meaningless. This is according to the, the scriptures. Yeah? It says all go to the same place, all come from the dust, and to all dust returns. Okay. To the, they all return to the dust. So animals are no different from us. Okay. They're made of the same thing, okay. so therefore so they have souls. Ah, In the goodness. book of Ecclesiastes, it says that the spirit of an animal goes back to God. So, so does us. So does our spirit goes back yes, to God. Of That's course. why it says God. The difference with, okay, what's the difference? It between, says we have the all same the eventuality, animal and humans. It says that we go back to the, the same kind of thing, bro. Of you, 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 so, you, you, so, you haven't got no so, Bible knowledge, so what's bro. What's the difference between an animal and a human? What do you mean? What's the difference? We, they, we are, we have got free will. They haven't. That's okay, all the so difference. They have a spirit. We have a spirit. No, no yeah, but listen. God says we're made of the same things. But we have a free will. They are programmed. The, the difference between a human and an animal is the soul. He doesn't <laughs> even know that. Oh man, I'll be honest, y'all. Yeah, yeah. This guy yeah. needs to go back to school. You are lightweight. And I've schooled him today. You are and I hope you all you just look at the things I say and see. You're equating. Bro. You're 
no, no, you bro, no, 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 I'm leaving that because you're just waffling too much, bro. You're saying you're waffling too much. You're waffling too much. You're, you're, you're not, you're not taking the stuff. Saying it for the cameras. You answer my last question. Go on. Go on. Go on. Ask the last question. So. You've deviated from my question. I've deviated, I'm just telling you everything that you okay, said. So Alright, right, go on, go, so on, go on. I'm gonna move on because yeah, go on, move on. you're not saying to you're not answering the I've question. I've answered all your questions though. Anyway, Gary, I'm you're representing one. Unitarians. Yeah. I'm not in, no, I'm representing not, the not, Bible. You're not a Unitarian. No, I'm representing the Bible. You're saying you're not a Unitarian, no. you're ashamed. I believe in the unity of purpose for all okay, three though. Okay. But I don't go to a Unitarian okay. church. I think you're hiding. I think you're hiding. Okay. So you dodged my question about whether I didn't dodge no, no a question human no. being has a created spirit or not. But I told you that they, they, they got just a soul. Give me, just give me a yes or no. What? Has a human got a created spirit? I told you. I'm sure if you rewind that video, you know what I said. I said to you. Just give me the answer, please. Well, I said to yes you earlier yes no. that the spirit, yeah, of God is not created, is it? It comes okay. from God. So you're saying to me. Yeah. And I'm going to take what you're saying, yeah. that you have an uncreated spirit. No, the spirit of God came from I God. Oh, I know. So I my know spirit that. comes from that. God. I know that. So is, is it, yeah. Is, is the spirit inside of you yeah. created or uncreated? By who? By the uncreated God. But God is the one that made me alive. So which spirit are you talking about? God made me alive, bro. Where are you going? Where are you getting at? So how can that be created? What am I, getting at? I don't What's understand where you're getting that a at. It's a trick question. It's a trick question to how? me because God made humans and blow into us life. Yes, I. So what? The you're spirit. Gonna live, don't get me wrong. You're gonna live. Have for, you got a spirit? You're gonna live for eternity. Yeah. But have you got a spirit? I have a spirit. And it came from God. Yes. Is yours created or uncreated? No. I'm asking you. But I'm telling you, mine. It comes from God. <laughs> My spirit comes oh, from God. Where do you come from? You can see this. Unitarians, at least you can see this. Bro, my ask. spirit comes from God. I know that. Right, does that mean it's created or uncreated? That. Does that mean it's uncreated or uncreated? So that's why I'm asking you. But what do you think? Don't what worry. do you think? You're asking what am I saying? But what am I saying then? I've just told you that my Listen, spirit comes from I'm God. So what do you mean? You. You're not helping me, bro. I understand. Well, tell me then. That you're going to live forever. Right. Tell me, is my spirit uncreated or not created? Because I believe out. my... Listen, you my spirit is from God. Yes. So is that uncreated or not okay. is so it created is by it, God? Is it Yahazia? I don't know. What's, no, what's I, I, please, I don't know. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. Yeah, Yaziah, 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 yeah, Zaya. Okay, second, I thought you forgot your name. Now, Yaziah. Okay, Yaziah. Mm. Is your spirit created, yes or no? I don't know. I know it's from God. Okay. So is so, it created, so, so is it not? Isn't this interesting? Yeah, you this tell is me. why your theology... Yeah. So, bro, so answer me. I'm, no, so, I'll tell so, you so, what. Yeah, go, I'll on, tell go, you this. go on. This is where I'm getting it. You've said on camera just now. Yeah. You don't know. I don't know, no. Whether your spirit. Because I say it's from God. I know it's from God, but I don't know. I don't know if it's created or not. It's created. Yeah. So you tell me, is it created or not? Yes. Right. Okay. It is created, created by who? Created by who? By the living God. What was this? What I said, bro? Created by the living God. I asked you point blank, and I agree. But then I tell you, my spirit is from God. I'm not so oh, man, come on, you're yeah, beating around the yeah, bush, bro. Yeah, I see it. Anyway, Yaziah, yeah, Yaziah. Yeah, yeah, sorry, Yaziah. Yeah, right? Yaziah, yeah, like Jeremiah, Yaziah. Yeah, yeah, I have, I asked you many, many times, you sit on the tape. I told you my spirit is from God, and I'm yeah? I'm glad I'm recording so, too, yeah, because yeah, I don't yeah, know record what, it. Yeah, how yeah. it's going to appear on this. Mm -hmm. But basically, I've made it very clear. Is your spirit created or un? And I told you it's from God. I and don't you know. Said, you said you don't know. Yeah. You don't know I, but I told you it's from God though, didn't I? Now, but I told you it's from God, didn't I? The significance of this, yeah. the significance of this, yeah. is if you said uncreated, <laughs> then we have a big problem. Because there's only one uncreated spirit. But I didn't say it was uncreated though, did I? You said you don't know, so... Yeah, I don't you, know, yeah. You sort of so sat, you, you said... Well, I, but you, you can admit yeah. that you sat on the fence, and it's okay. But I didn't know, because I know that my spirit is from God. So I don't That's know, an and I don't believe that That's God, an and you're, I don't believe that God, God, God. You are equivocating. Yeah, I don't believe that God creates spirits. You know God you're, is God. You're, God. You're equivocating. Yeah. Anyway, God's spirit. Anyway, anyway. But listen. Is is God's spirit? Now you're you're saying I want I'm waffling. But you are waffling, bro. As you're going home. Yeah. 
you go on to Google. You don't need to go on to Google. And you just work out no, the no. difference between I've, creative listen, and uncreative. Listen, now, anyway. God, God, anyway, God so, makes so, sim so, makes so, things so, simple so, to people like me. Okay. Yeah. Good. Not 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 um, things so, that people can't understand. So, so yeah? we've established. You don't know what your spirit is. I, I didn't say that. I don't listen, you bro. Don't you ask know me if it is created because it's from God. Created. It's from God. I, I'm not God, yes, am I? I know. You, that's why you said you don't know. Because I don't know. Yeah, that's you right. You know it's from God, and I yeah, agree. It's from God. I yeah. believe my spirit is from God. Yeah. But, you but don't yours know is created. If the nature of your spirit yeah. is created or uncreated. You don't know. I don't know because I'm going. I don't good, need good, to look good. that way because that ain't got so, nothing to so do with me, anything. So let me help you now. The spirit. Mm -hmm. That was in the Lord Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Yes, yeah, Holy Spirit. It is uncreated. But it's Holy Spirit he's got in it. Okay. So this is why. Yeah, but it's Holy Spirit, isn't it? What? What Jesus had. It's, remember the verse where it talks about in him. Yeah, but it's Holy Spirit he's got there. Isn't it? In him. Yeah. Dwelt the what? I don't know. You tell God's me. Godhead. No, 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 oh, Godhead. Show me Godhead in the Bible. Oh, you don't believe Godhead is in the Bible? Yeah, but, but in your probably it might be, but I don't, but it's right in the original. So you just want to see anywhere? No, it God. wasn't in the original text. Okay. Godhead was not in the For original the text. the invisible things of him, yeah. from the creation of God, or creation of the world, sorry, are clearly seen, being understood by the things that are made. Yeah. Even his eternal power and Godhead. Yeah, so you put Godhead there. They put Godhead, I put Godhead, there. Godhead there. No, me, they did, yeah, yeah. Me, what, what, what translation? What translation of the Godhead? <laughs> James King Shane. Listen, Godhead is not in the original text. So that they are without excuse. What does Godhead mean? What, no, Godhead is not. Listen, Godhead is not in the original scriptures, bro. So let me go to. That was put in there. You research it. Godhead wasn't there. Godhead wasn't in the original text, bro. It wasn't. What I want to show you. Same Colossians you brought. I still got your mic, man. So, look what it says. This is even better, actually. It says in Colossians 1.19. And it's interesting because sometimes you have to go through this quite a lot. So I've shown you one verse where it says Godhead. But look at this. For it pleased the Father that in him should all fullness dwell. So, in Christ, the divine nature dwelt in Christ. Yeah, but so his yeah, spirit okay. was all fullness. So, Jesus didn't have a created spirit. Yeah, you're preaching so, to me now. Is that what you believe? <laughs> you're preaching, bro. No, 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 no. You're, you're not no, teaching no, no. me nothing. It don't matter. You're preaching. Because by the grace of God, people watching, they will learn something about Unitarians like you. Yeah, but yeah. So look, not, yeah, look, yeah, look, yeah, look yeah, what it says. For it pleased the Father that in him should all fullness dwell. Yeah, but I prove to you, I prove to you wait, wait. that Jesus fullness, is not fullness of what? God Almighty. Fullness of what? Yeah, it doesn't. It, 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 I prove to you that Jesus is not God Can you Almighty. Hear it again? Fullness of what? Yeah. Mm. Fullness of what? What does it say there? Yeah. For it pleased fullness. the Father that in Him should all fullness, fullness dwell. dwell. Fullness of what? I don't know. What does it say? Fullness of what? Are you read this verse? Now show me the fullness of what? No, look, 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 read it. Yeah, the fullness of what? What does it say? It pleased the Father that in Him should all fullness dwell. The, what? What fullness of what? Okay. Show me. And having made peace through blood of the cross by him to reconcile all things unto himself, by him I say whether they be things in earth or things in heaven. Okay. That's one straight over my head because you don't say fullness of what? You have to read the context. Yeah. Okay. But, but in terms of, in terms of, I let Michael, you probably have a question, but just give me one second. I was going to say, I'm just going to warn you, he does 10 hour life. <laughs> He's a joker. So you want to never end. Yeah, yeah. What that? What no, say? he says you do a 10 hour live stream, but I'm going to go soon. Anyway, but 10 hour live yeah. stream. Yeah. But anyway. See, but this is the thing. You wanted, you had a question and obviously we were discussing yeah. about Jesus. Is Jesus God? Is Jesus created? And he's saying 10 hour live stream, as if to say people can't reason together yeah. and go through things in detail. 
we, you know, there's so much more to go through. There's a lot more to How, go through. We'll, however, have a, we'll have a part two, all right? However, we'll have a part two. However, <laughs> I have my, my simple point to you was, and it's so simple, and I don't know whether it's going to be on this video um, to the Unitarian audience, but it's definitely going to be on the yeah. Godhead channel. Okay. Is this. Yeah. We spoke about whether your spirit was created or uncreated. You said you don't know. According to the Bible, your spirit is created. Yeah, you're beating around the bush all these things, no, bro. This is the last, this is the yeah, You're just beating this around is, the bush. This is the key bit. And you're giving me why your interpretation of now, things. So Jesus, yeah. his spirit was uncreated. Do you believe that? What? Which spirit? Which if one are you talking about now? Your spirit is created. Well, you just told me that you told me that my spirit was now created, you, didn't you? Don't dodge. Yeah, I'm not dodging nothing, bro. Be a man. But you, you, be a man. <laughs> yeah, you be a man, bro. Okay. So, but you're so, you're preaching and so you're you're spirit, coming from different spirit, different angles. Is your spirit the created spirit? I don't know. You tell me. Look at this guy. Yeah. You tell me. So, I'm so confused with all this nonsense you have, that I'm just asking him now to give the answer. You have thrown Unitarianism. You have thrown Trinitarian of trash. You have thrown Trinitarian you why, into you've nothingness. You've thrown Unitarian into under the bus. You've thrown it in the waste pile. Yeah. Because you're saying you're still sitting on the fence, and you're saying yeah. But you, spirit. But, I don't know. But, you, but you've had no defense of Trinity. How can you even dare yeah. to stand? But you have no defense of Trinity, say, bro. And say no. Let's, you haven't. Let's, you, you haven't let's, proved let's, let's anything, brother. You're standing here, and you can't even say that your spirit is not. Unclear. But you haven't proved anything, you bro. Our discussion think, was about the Trinity, you and you haven't proved think, a thing, I th bro. I think you literally think you're God. No, you That's haven't proved I, a thing. Bro. I think I think you've got this concept that you are like um. He hasn't proved the Trinity. He hasn't is your proved spirit a thing. Uncreated? He has just been going, beating around the bush. There's only one yeah, yeah. uncreated spirit. Anyway, bro, I gotta go, man. I gotta go. We just, we, 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 we'll finish off. Okay, we'll, do, so we'll do a part two. Take your, take your mic. We'll do a part two. This last, this last bit, last bit. And we'll then we're done. We're two. done. This is the last bit. This is the last bit. My dinner is waiting. I know Michael wants to cut it so that you look good. But it's but okay. you don't have to cut it so I don't. No, no, no. no. But Michael, Michael, no, Michael's, got one, it, right. Michael's got he a good one there. Michael's got a good one there. cut it so yeah. you look good. Don't worry, he's no, going to no, no, try and help you. No. But okay, but let's look at this. Am Michael's going to have loads of views on this. It won't surprise me. Okay, so look, look at this. Because what Michael, do you see, think he's proved anything? What they're going to see yes. is Have if Michael proven? speaks, I'm going to yeah. bring him. I don't think you care. I literally think Michael and you yeah. don't care what the Trinitarian position is. I know what your position is, no, no, but I know it's care. not right, it's not correct. Because it's not biblical. Firstly, you would have done your homework first. But there's no need to be because I know it's not Before biblical, bro. You come and talk to But I know it's not biblical. You don't even know what your spirit the is. The word Trinity is not even you in the Bible, even bro. You don't know if your spirit is created or not. You uncreated. can't even show me the Trinity in the Bible. Even, how can you. Just by the process of elimination, yeah. you would say, now nah, my spirit can't be up. But you can't even show me the Trinity in the Bible, bro. You should be saying your you spirit. You can't even say the word Trinity. You should be saying your spirit is created. You, should, you, have, you, you haven't have proved to me the Trinity, bro. bro. Come on, man. Bro, man. You've got this, all this thing here. You're you haven't proved anything, man. In confusion. Anyway, anyway, listen, man. Okay, let's, like go I said, on, I just on. want to read this bit. Okay, do you agree with this verse? Go on. Micah 5, verse 2. But thou Bethlehem Ephrata, yep. though thou be among I know it. the thousands of Judah, yep. yet out of thee shall he come forth unto me, yep. that is to be ruler in Israel, who is going forth, have been from of old, yep. from everlasting. Yeah, speaking about Jesus. Okay. Yes. So, you have a pro so this is about I have no Jesus. problem with that. Yes, yeah, about because that's where it's from. I'm actually... Bethlehem, Be uh, Bethlehem will come from Ephrata, okay. and he is going to have, yeah, from okay. everlasting, yeah. Okay. Because yeah. it tells you that the kingdom of God yeah, on earth and all that will last forever. This is talking about his. This is talking about the essence of it. He's no. from everlasting. Yeah, no, he's, he's, he has no beginning. No, it doesn't say he's from everlasting. Guys, do your homework. Where's it say? Where's it say? Where's it say he's from? Where's it say? Where's it say he's from everlasting? That scripture. You don't believe it's there? No, show me it where it says it. No, the one you just read me. I'll read it to you. Don't worry. Yeah, show me where it says it. Okay. Wait, that same one you just read. read anyway. That well, it says he's he's from everlasting. Okay. So because because the thing is that he had a he had a beginning. Because okay. I showed you in the scriptures that he had a beginning. The firstborn of all creation. Okay. In subjective to God. Okay. okay. So in the book of Hebrews, yeah, I'm gonna to go to Michael 5 verse 2 where I just was. So it says, But thou Bethlehem Ephrata, yep. 
Though thou be among the thousands of Judah, yet out of thee shall he come forth, that is to be ruler in Israel, whose going forth have been from of old. Yes, that's right, you know what he has? From where? Yeah, it says it's from old, yeah. From where? From, yeah. Oh, say, yeah, it, yeah. say it, say all right, it. Let me, all right, it says there, from he has been from of old, from everlasting, yes. Hallelujah, yes. praise yes. the Lord. But it doesn't mean that, it, yeah, Jesus. yeah, everlasting of, from when? Thank you, Jesus. Yeah. From everlasting. Yeah. If you are from but, everlasting. But what's the context? Yeah, <laughs> what's, the, what's the context of this? Okay. Yeah. If bro, you, no, but bro. how can it, if you're from of old, how can it go forward? Everlasting, that's what it means. So if you're from of old, <laughs> this guy is, this guy, this guy is, this guy is, this guy how can that mean it, listen. that it's just going forward? Bro. Denied. Jesus, listen, anyway. Anyway, let, let's let's make it. Of old. Yeah, I gotta go, man. So let's just let's just, so, let's just call it a day, bro. Clear for us. Messianic prophecy that he is divine and does not have no beginning. He has a beginning because the scripture says no he ends. has. This is from of old, not yeah. from eternity. Yes, yeah, right. This, anyway, the scriptures tells us anyway that so, he's, okay. he's a beginning. Okay. So okay. unless you okay. unless you so, uh, you're not you're so not you're saying, gonna so, agree with the scriptures. So you're saying you're comfortable with Jesus, the spirit of Jesus, this spirit that was in Jesus as created. No, say it, Michael, because you're behind the camera, you're not in front of me. You're not listening, you're not listening to, no, say, not listening say, to the scripture, bro. It, no, 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 it's okay. Let's get anyway, I'm gonna go, man. No, it's cold, man. I know it's cold. Take it. Um, we're, we're both cold, don't run away. So, 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 we're all on tape. So, and you wanna help your brothers, man. You don't wanna just leave them out. So, but he, so the question is, the question is, do you believe the spirit of Jesus, okay? Do you believe that spirit is created or uncreated? That is the crossroads between you and us. Do you believe that spirit in Jesus is created or uncreated? Give me an answer, please. Uh, I would know since I wasn't there, but I go by what the Bible says, Exactly. So I'm not going to invent my own... Yeah, yeah, give us the answer. Um, you really should it to you. No, 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 Michael. I've really, I've, so, so I've told him all the things. It, no, no, no. He forgot all the things twist. I discussed with him earlier. Don't try and twist. And he's don't twisting try and everything. Hide. Don't try and do anything. Your man, your grown man. Yeah. Tell me mm. in plain English. Mm. Is the spirit of Christ created or uncreated? Yes or no? I wasn't there. This guy does. He doesn't know. He doesn't know. He's, he's, he's struggling. He doesn't know. He's over the struggle. He's panicking. You give me the answer. <laughs> and he's having a tough, tough time. You tell me. The spirit of Christ is uncreated. Oh, so, so Colossians is wrong. Okay. What's, what's wrong about Colossians? <laughs> yes. The book of so, Colossians where he says the first born of all creation is all wrong. All, and the fact that he's subjective to God is all wrong. What about Colossians Everything is wrong, it, no. according to him. Same Colossians you're talking You don't believe yeah. the Bible, bro. Yeah. You don't oh, believe, me, you me, don't me, believe me, the Bible. Is this the same person? Yeah. That's the problem. Guys, I'm you, so glad. Yeah, bro, you don't so believe the Bible. You've got it in your hand and you've got your own take on everything. What take? All the things you said. It's on camera, bro. That doesn't even know. It's on camera. his spirit is created or uncreated. But I told you, I told you, but I don't. I know that, do I? But I told you he's from God, didn't oh. I? But I told you he's from God. Yes, he's, he a he's so patronized, isn't he? He knows he's lost to them. He's lost the debate, isn't he? If you don't, so he has to patronize. From the moment you don't know that, you've lost, that, that, you've lost the you debate, bro. Answer, anyway, let the, let the audience, let the audience, don't want to cut the video, I want to watch it. lightweight, you're a featherweight. <laughs> <laughs> he's lost. Even a featherweight, you're he, minimum weight. He can't prove anything. Because the reason why you're a featherweight, you don't even know your own nature. Okay. He doesn't know. If you say so. He doesn't know. We weren't there, were we? We exactly. So when we made that were self, we there in the beginning? We when Adam self. and Eve was created, were we there? No. Why are you saying what you're, why are you saying that? Because you are but Adam you don't have to be there. But Adam and Eve was created we though, the weren't Bible. they? So we should make it up. But no, Adam and Eve no, was no. created though, we weren't don't they? make it up, we go to the Bible and we read and we exegete it correctly. And it says that he was the firstborn of all creation. Yeah. So is that so you're, I've just showed you a verse which says he's from of old. Yeah. Everlasting. I've asked you a simple question. He is a simple he's a, question. Is his spirit created or uncreated? Whose spirit? Answer man? the question. Whose is spirit? It? Jesus. I was guys, there. man. That's what I thought. Whose spirit are you talking about? Is spirit Yazir, or Jesus? Like, Whose oh, spirit is it? Yazir, you're struggling. You need to. I've already defeated you already. You need to go home. You ain't got no answer. You need to make yourself a cup of tea. He knocks around. He beats around the bush. Come out with this and come out with that. And no one demands it. You know what I mean? Get, you know. 
I love my rice and peas. Yeah. You need to go and cook yourself some. I've had mine already, yeah. man. You need to get more. I'm going to get mine too, man. I'm going to get more. Man, listen. This guy's having a tough time. He doesn't even know. Let's watch the video and see. He can't answer. He can't answer nothing, bro. You don't even know what your spirit is. Yeah, but that's got nothing to do with Trinity. Listen, that's got nothing to do with the Trinity, brother. Yeah, so all them things is just bits of much to add. What would he say if he said both? What would he say? You know how some Christians say Jesus. He said he doesn't know. Can I ask, ask him? He's just patronizing yeah, 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 now. Hold on, hold on. Let me ask you a question. Can I ask go, a question? Go ahead, go ahead. You see, you know how Christians... I was, I was, I was trying to get answer out of him, but he's going to hide behind okay, the camera. Okay. See how Christians <laughs> now, nowadays, yeah, they say that Jesus is... Comedian, man. 100% God and 100% man. So what would you say if someone said to you that Jesus was 100% man and... 100, I mean, sorry, his spirit was created and uncreated. What would you say if someone said yeah, so this is what I'm saying. We don't believe yeah. that the spirit of Christ yeah. is created. Uh, Unless you can show me a verse where it says his spirit I've already show, I've already showed him that no, no, no. Jesus is the firstborn of all creation did, and was created you, by God. Did you show showed me his spirit was created? But I've showed you that he's, 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 I've told you he's the firstborn of all creation. And I've showed you that he's, he's, he tells you twice in there that he's the first beginning of the creation by God. I think so he was created I think by God. Okay, can I take no, it? I think you need I, to when show. I was here he said Jesus is not the first man God created. So because he's not the first man, it cannot be a creation of flesh. That has to be spirit. Yeah. That's so the argument was right. And then I showed I think you He didn't show I think, he I didn't show nothing, there. brother. I think you I think you said well. Yes, I showed you I showed him the amplified. You didn't show when, nothing, bro. Yeah, 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 no, I'm I'm gonna, gonna, read it on the video he, so he we can see. He just said it though, he just said it. We'll see it on the video. But you so got, he's, he's, you got no answers. This he is genuine. Repeats a lot. He repeats a lot, doesn't he? I, I come repeat. up with all this nonsense. For people like him. It's like, <laughs> you know what, in like... Godhead, you man. You, you teach Lord, nursery, Godhead. Like sometimes. I'm going to come back for a part two. I've got something else to show that I've never had a chance to show. The people and that are And you're going to mess you up completely. You have to let them know. And you're going to be... I know you're going to be around the bush. you're going to mess me up now, but you've been messed up. Because you don't even know what your spirit is, but yet you want to... But that's got nothing to do with... Got, stand here. But that's got nothing that's to do with Trinity, it's, bro. It's, it's a well, bit, the discussion was about the Trinity. Yeah. Yeah. My spirit is yeah. created. Yeah, so it's the same as ours then, isn't it? Because we're the same as you. So, this guy... <laughs> one second, one second, one second, Michael. Oh, this guy yeah. wants to talk about Jesus. Oh, Jesus is uh, created. Of course he's created. That's what the scripture says, bro. Man, you's a lightweight. But the I scripture you says so. I've showed you, you the scriptures. No, Didn't I show him the scriptures? The I showed him all why, the scriptures. The and he why. couldn't rebut them. The he just why. came up with nonsense. If you don't even know what your spirit is. But Jesus said he's got a God. How dare you? But Jesus even said he's got a God. Jesus from so he can't be the same. How can a God have a God? Have some respect. Bro, come on, you, you listen, respect. mate. You yeah, listen. Have some respect. <laughs> you know why you should have some respect? I asked him. It's, it's I asked him. Uh, yeah, I know it's a long time. What if is, Jesus has got God, is, he can't I be God. I asked him, what is his spirit? He said, I don't know. I said, I said to him, is it uncreated or created? He said he doesn't know. Okay, can I take the discussion? So, 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 once again, he wants to now come to Jesus. You're not qualified. Yeah, no, no, you're, you're I'm not coming to Trinity. No, no, no. You're not qualified. Hey, now, what, what I'm gonna, I'll come to you, brother. Come to you. What was, you're saying, how do I know yeah. that my spirit is created? Because I, have, I am born into a finite realm. Okay, I have a beginning and I have a new. There was a start to my existence. And that's the question I wanted to work out with him. What is there a start to your existence? And if there is a start to your existence, then that means you're created being. Your spirit is created. But what's it got if to do with the have Trinity a though? Start, now with Jesus, there is no start. Of course there's a start, the scripture says that. Adam is a created being. When was his spirit created? Yeah. When, 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 obviously when the Pope said, uh, Genesis 1 26, let us make man in our image. The Father spoke him into existence. He doesn't say that. Just say properly what happened. Okay. So what we see mm. in, uh, in Genesis 1 26, we'll go there, no problem. So you want to know what happened? We went through this already. Yeah, we did. No, we went through it. So but there was a beginning. There's a beginning to Adam, and there was an end to Adam. Yeah, but okay. But his spirit is, in terms of his spirit, it, there was a beginning for his existence. He was created. Yeah. 
So, so you're creative, then, aren't you? I'm creative. You're yes. creative. I know. Well, if you didn't know, if you didn't know. Yeah, but listen. But I told you, my spirit comes from God, didn't no, I? You're not qualified. To but talk why about am I Jesus. supposed to talk about? You need why to know am I going to find out where my spirit? Why? 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 I'm not on about that. I'm talking about the Trinity. Oh no, yeah. When are you going to get back to me then? You know what I mean? Who, who's going to? You know what I mean? Why am I interested in whether my spirit is created or not? I'm just an existing being. Why do I? You're knocking around, mate. This guy, man. Yeah, we went to see. He's got no answer, bro. You, he's got no. No answer. He just blabbers all this Listen, nonsense. I you cannot him, defend I nothing. I asked, I asked him a question. You cannot answer I nothing, him, I said bro. To him, is, is your this, spirit this created? This is what he's doing. Created. I told you I didn't know. Okay, Paul. What's your spirit? Is what? What's your spirit? Is it created or unfit? He answered that in two seconds. Yeah, but I didn't know. This guy but I, did, I, I, but I don't know. I'm not interested in my spirit, bro. Did you say you don't know? I'm not, yeah, I did. I told you about them. He said he didn't know. So now we wait yeah. for you. <laughs> I didn't know. I don't know my spirit. Well, my spirit. I'm not, all I know is I said to him, <laughs> God made me. Yeah, God is come from God. You believe that? So, so God oh didn't create me then? Oh my gosh, it. man. He doesn't did, even did, know God blow, did God blow the spirit into me? God blowed the spirit into Adam and Eve, didn't he? <laughs> anyway, is that true? There is a spirit me, that God... Here, so, so, yeah, see, me, listen. <laughs> this guy's just patronising. He's the wrong Talk guy. Nonsense. 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 He's got defeated and he's got nonsense. He will, he'll give you... No, he can't give me nothing. He's already been defeated. I said to him... He can't answer nothing. What, what are you waiting for? Is your listen. spirit created or uncreated? So what? Anyone, sh everyone should say. But I don't. No, 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 no. But I don't know. It's How should created. I know? He took two seconds. But I don't know, bro. Yeah, because you need to go and do your homework. But I don't need to know what you say. Go back to school. because God. Listen. That's why I said you're God not didn't ask Adam about whether he's created or not, did he? You're not qualified, man. You're not qualified for nothing, bro. I've already destroyed don't you, come brother. To Jesus and bro, say, I've already and destroyed you, don't, don't, and you got no don't, answer. Don't, it's all don't on come video. To Jesus You've been destroyed, brother. Listen, there ain't no Godhead. You've been destroyed. Now is that is. He's been, he's been destroyed, bro. This guy's been destroyed. Yeah, but I'm, I don't believe in Trinity. I'm a biblical Christian. But I just destroyed him and he, he's just coming up with nonsense. No, I'm not. I'm just, 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 I'm a biblical. I, re, I go by what the Bible says. He destroyed himself. Yeah? But he's a Trinitarian. Okay. They, he can't even show me the word Trinity in the Bible. But he's talking about Trinity. The concept is okay, He can't even show me. Concept. concept. But there's but, 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 but listen. I showed him there's Godhead. No I showed him Godhead. There's no concept. There's no concept. The, the, the first century Christians didn't believe in no Trinity, bro. Yeah, so, yeah, no first century Christian had no Trinity. Trinity came at nice the, the cast of nice Nicaea, bro. There were no Trinity before that. Okay. It's a man-made concept, bro. Now it's a man. Listen, the first century Christians did not believe in Trinity, bro. You can't show me one of them that believed in the Trinity. Hey, wanna well, take these guys? Take this. Take your. Take, oh, you know when you read the Bible. Take them. I gotta go.